Testing, testing. Can you guys talk? Hello. Uh, let me Hello. let me listen to the stream and see I fixed what it. I can hear. I fixed it. You Don't fixed worry. It? Okay. Sorry okay. about that, Shadow. Hi, Shadow. I, 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 thank, I thanked you for the two months. Uh, yes, I thought zombie. I thought the zombie music was fitting for this situation. I apologize for the silent start of the stream. I, of course, there's technical difficulties because why would Zero's life be easy? Um, but thank hey, you so much for streaming for us, Zero. I know it's not easy. Thank you. Well, either way. Uh, the big boy takes 13 damage, get fucked, big zombie man. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. People dive to big heal, except nope. fuck you, it hurt. Uh, it's okay. it's so, he, no, his resistance 3 is back now. Oh yeah, was that damage taken into account? Oh, okay, that's perfectly fine. Was that damage taken into account, the fact that he doesn't have resistance 3? Yes, all that damage has. Okay. Awesome. Shadow, Shadow just gave five dollars in bits. Thank you. Hey, Shadow, who the fuck do you want to help? Do you want to help the heroes, or do you want to give me another hero point, a villain point, to really fuck them over? Well, you can only have one more, fucker. Yeah, I can only have we one more, but I will immediately use it. You already have two. Also, you... use anyway. our hero points. <laughs> Ashay. Ashay, conti uh, please continue. Eshe is going to, first and foremost, enter her rage. Uh, please add three hero points to the pool. Right. Would you also, Shadow, would you also like to use one of, uh, cause that's, so each hero, each point is worth a dollar. You gave five. Would you like to fill up both sides? Shadow's being very kind. Aww, Shadow's thank the you reason. So much, Shadow. Shadow's the reason that y'all, I had three points to begin with. Yeah, let's make it thank fair. You. Three points on all sides. Thank you very much. <laughs> Can I spend a hero point to negate your villain point? It's no. A... Eshe... If I can't use my villain points to negate your hero points. Fair enough. Can I spend a hero point to get another hero point? I mean, if it's cool Eshe, enough, technically, yes. Sorry, Eli, go ahead. Eshe, uh, basically... Uh, words, words, words. Eshe's rage is similar but different. With the amazing work of Hanu's mechanical mastery, her face shows what you assume it looked like underneath her mask. A deadly focused calm that pierces through the rage and disgust that was on her face before. But uh, her robotic body also begins uh, to glow. You can see the vibrations coming off of it, and if there were air, it would be humming. Uh, rather than air quotes exhaling, as she usually does, or her body begins to constantly outgas steam. And she lifts up her membele with the, the patterns on it and attempts to slash it across this thing. <laughs> and once again, the slash gives the image of Percival. You forgot to target? Oops, forgot to target the dude. Sorry about that. I believe 17 I believe... hits though, right? I believe 17 hits. He is flat for too. Yeah, 17 does hit. So add 10 to that damage. All right. And yes, add 10, because with the power of Percival, the chalk drawing somehow glows in the light, and you can see something like the sun shine out of this thing's wounds, and the Mambele comes off somehow un... un... unbloodied. Where do you strike to finish this thing off? How do you want to do this? Ah, yes. <laughs> Eshe will move over to this thing's head where it's lying down and say, Peace. Silently. And then slice its head off cleanly. And this, this is what you want a thaumaturge in the party? 
Uh, yep. I spend my villain points uh -oh. to to <laughs> to activate an ability here. So you dealt Six. how much damage? Twelve minus uh, three. Twenty-two. Nine. Twenty-two. Nineteen. Okay, thank you for catching that. I forgot the minus three. So nineteen. Kerchunk. Um. Uh, <laughs> What? What happened? I saw plus I 44. Saw plus 44. <laughs> um, except it's going to be then minus 19, which... Yep. Uh, that's fine. Uh, well, good news! Said Eshe moved, uh, uh, I'm okay with Eshe having moved like that, so... Uh, in case left? this fat fuck decides to get up... Uh, uh, nah, I decided to have Eshe move for drama purposes, no. so... Uh, oh yeah, you, you enraged, I forgot. Yep, uh, so you this thing is to understanding pinned you bring this sword down on the medical officer mm. and oh, you can feel its spine its neck bones biting into your blade as you bring it and you bring with such force but there is a vibration through your blade that is not just the striking it is this almost it's silent, but you can feel it reverberating through your blade and up your arm and into your chest cavity of pure, unadulterated rage. Um, as this thing enters rage. Oh, motherfucker. And it'll reduce its AC, but increases its damage. Uh, shit. She you did says, not need help. Into the void. You did not need help. <laughs> Um, that, that is my villain point, I'm doing that, but it's not its turn, actually. Uh, this thing isn't pinned, it is under the thing, so it, it has to crawl out and then get up. Which is too, mm. too active, but it's not going to get up, it's actually just gonna crawl out over here, and attack Nina! I forgot about that little die. It is prone, so it does take a penalty to hit, so... It does! Good. I think these I'm guys sorry, actually have laugh. three actions on like the big boy. They do, they do actually. Uh so he comes crawling out, pushing silently pushing uh the things out of his way, grabbing onto the, the bent uh, metal flooring to get purchased. His claw, his uh, his bony fingers uh, digging in the, the 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 bony fingers and the and the extended nails of his, because the skin pulled back slightly. Dragged himself forward and takes a swipe at you. Dodge it, you dodge easily. But then he goes for a second one. Ah, ah. cruel. The device. minus five can cool. be a pain sometimes. Yeah, but hey, yeah, that's see, fine. This is this is why I like to make one big attack. That's fair. Um, and yeah, so he, he's, you imagine that he's like, blah, 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 but in the void of space, no one can hear you. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> no one can hear you gibber. <laughs> no one can hear you make a fool of yourself. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's good thing. So, Hanu feels appreciative for the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, thing of interest. Would he like to stand up? No, no. He's going to try and punch Eshe. To be entirely Excellent. honest, because um, she just nearly decapitated him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now hold on. Rage only does increase damage and increase AC. Does it doesn't increase attack, right? No, nope. no attack. Uh, just a, just no, damage. It increases damage. You can pull okay. the damage thing from. You can pull the rage effect from when Ash oh, does the. Yeah, right, 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 right. Uh, if it has a rage. specific type of rage, though, it might no. be able to. Wait, take Eli. Damage effect. Eli, real quick, can oh, yeah. you post your attack of opportunity ability? Yes, I can. Uh, dip, 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 dip. Oh, something might, funny is about up. to happen. Uses a concentrate manipulator move action. Guess what trait rage has? Uh, 
he went into rage as a villain point. Oh yeah, no, I I, yeah, I absolutely sure that believe counts. that doesn't work. Yeah, I just sure wanted to remember what traits. What? Thank you for reminding me, though. Yeah, good to remember. It also affects concentrate. So, so mm -hmm. with your sword like halfway into his neck, he's going to reach up grab the the fists that are around that that thing and then with the other hand just try to clock you in the side of the head ashley's membele is actually only one-handed at the moment oh, so he okay. was only able to get one of her hands oh no oh yes excellent oh <laughs> uh, yeah hey percival he i think it's time down. for he... you to reduce damage yeah, yeah. So no, actually, actually, he doesn't I grab get hit he doesn't, again. Yeah, he doesn't grab your hand. He grabs your arm and pulls you down as he just fucking like f from the ground just uppercuts. Not even uppercuts because that's not in the right sword. Just right into your chin. I imagine it is sort of like a. Oh, thank God! Move. Oh. <laughs> thank so you, will, God. I you rolled take... minimum. You will take eight damage, Eli, so get four back from Percival. I'm sorry. Oh. Actually, no, I'm not sorry. Uh, I'm thankful. <laughs> Thank you, yeah, Percival. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and then you, you can you do take that. a step for free. He. Yep. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Actually, uh, yeah, yep. she, she'll move pointlessly over up onto the bed. Yep. Uh, and so. That like, will save you like, for being you thrown down. into the other zombie punches yep. you up and using the momentum from the punch and the low gravity of the asteroid you're able to like whoop, up under the bed no problem uh mm -hmm. but he's going to uh he's going to like the hand that was grabbing you is going to come over and try to like grab and crush your ankle and he's going to make another attack against you excellent yep. oh That's hit by fine. one no not even hit by one hit exactly yep Excellent. Fucking rage. <gasps> God, if only I got that <laughs> on the crit. Ah! Alright. I'm sorry, 16 my damage love. as he crushes your ankle. Ooh! Rip, rip it from his grasp. But yeah, he's he he went for you. Um. Puzzle, this turn? Tis your turn. Yay. Actually, not looking hot. Half the reason I spent the villain point was so that the like this dude didn't die. You know, immediately upon so round like, one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, like, yeah. Hey, I'm okay with it. We we've been kind of creaming him, so. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hundred percent. Y'all have the exact thing you need to like fuck this guy up. So, Puzzle, kick his ass. Oh, so close. Uh -huh. And he does have his resistance back. Your shield is no longer that raised, by this, Marty. I know, I'll put it up. The funny thing is, the funny thing I found out that they're going rage is that although he took damage, the rage technically gives him more health. <laughs> yes. Thank God he has low, uh, AC, low AC. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He has no, he has no self-preservation. Oh, he's looking rough again. He's looking rough again. He's he's being held together by pure rage. He refuses to die. Man too angry to die. To die. Janina. Ellen, you're muted. Ellen, you're muted. Ellen? I know. Okay, there right. you go. Just want to make sure you knew. Mm -hmm. uh, Making a religion who's check. Religion on the small um, guy or the big guy? Big guy. Big guy. Pass. What you looking for? Uh, anything we don't know yet. Um. Oh, actually, real quick, that actually made me to go looking. Um. Of interest, uh, Pathfinder 2e push. So I forgot this man pushes you back five feet. 
Fortunately, I uh, dodged so that he couldn't... I think that the... Uh, I think that means he couldn't shove me into that zombie. No, it would have been away from him. He doesn't really mm -hmm. have like a... Like, I'm going to push you in this direction. Um, Eshe can take more damage from being crammed in the wall. Yeah, that's what no. I was going to do, but no. I... No? No, that's not how that ability does work. How do you mean? Pushing does, doesn't deal damage. Okay. Not normally, but, uh, you know. Hold on. This is someone being shoved directly into a wall. No wall. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, improved knockdown. Okay, thank you. It was improved. It was, it, uh... <laughs> Automatically knocks. All right, there's no save. All right, um, take an additional two damage as you, like, okay. get slammed up against the wall. Eshe gets absolutely sunned by this monster. Yeah. Uh, anyway, sorry about that. Uh, so anything else you don't know? Um, Big fucker. You don't know it saves? It's exact saves. You know Reflex is its lowest. That's a gimme. Would we know which one is its highest, I say? Obviously. I think we could safely guess its fortitude. Yeah, it's got a good chance. Uh, but, like, I mean, you know fortitude is highest, reflex is lowest, but you don't know exact numbers. Um, you know... You know fortitude, because he wrote a fortitude to save earlier. Yeah. Oh, right. So... I don't think there's anything in particular, unless you want very spe you unless you want specific numbers. I don't think so. Uh, why don't why don't we get uh, specific numbers? All right, what are you looking for? Saints. Yeah, I'll give you all. I'll give you all of them. Uh, plus ten for it. Plus three reflex. Plus six will. Awesome. Okay. Yep. Thank you, dear. Theoretical hit. Hmm. Okay. I am going to take that hit. Ten damage. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. Oh, he's and looking rough. Stride. And then I'm going to battle medicine. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now, uh, I do want to uh, make sure it's clarified that your battle medicine makes them immune for 24 hours, right? Nope. An hour? One hour. Because I'm a forensic investigator. Ah, uh, because you're a forensic investigator. Right, 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 right. Okay, quick. Okay. Still, we can't so do it about taking... combat. Yeah, yeah, but I was thinking about taking it, but then I looked as like, we, uh, 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 we immune for 24 hours. I was like, oh, that's rough. But yeah, yeah for forensic, combat, forensic investigator. It's the worst fucking combat ever. 11 yeah, and I'm healing. A medic, so I have one exception once per day. Nice. Hell yeah. Alright. So good good uh, old eleven to you. Yeah. And then you uh, drag Hanu. Them, or click the immune button. Okay. Um Hanu uh is still fury mode. Um you feel if it were possible for him to have a rage, he would be in rage. Um <laughs> Oh oh sorry. I misunderstood and thought that went to Hanu for some reason. No, nope, that's you. Don't we'll take six. Take that six oh, back and heal it. eleven. Sorry, Plus... hit the wrong thingy. Okay. Um, I am going to spell strike. Yep. Spell cheese. And then grab that in Um. So I am going to hit a gouging claw. I'm doing to do slashing damage. Bell strike! Critic 
Critical hit! Wait, what? Critical hit! What did you roll to hit? 24! 24, oh. that's flat voted. Oh god. Double that! Uh, take persistent damage! Critical hit! Stop. Stop. <laughs> was that a gremlin? Yeah, it was a gremlin. Yeah. Persistent damage. Uh, hmm. Uh, if it dealt persistent damage normally, then... The persistent uh, does not double. Okay. Yep. Let me just hit the... Uh huh. The, the, the service button. I'm going to Sorry. Uh, so yeah, a motherfucker takes a lot of damage, and if I remember right, ain't he weak to critical hits? Double his level? Oh, right, with the critical hit. How do you want to do this? <laughs> <laughs> so, Hanu being the Magus who loves the critical hit button. Um, Hanu unhinges his jaw. Again, his body shouldn't be able to do this. He swings his fan, his arm, the, the silicon fur looking real, real animal hair. As this creature's head is decapitated for a second, and then he catches it with his other hand and holds the head up. Alas, poor Yorick. Ah, uh, he looks like he's screaming. You can't hear anything. <laughs> mm -hmm. As soon as... Uh, for anyone Does wondering, by the, the way... Thing, Hatter? Oh, yes? That was 35 damage in total. Jesus. That was like a third of his health in one hit without the critical <laughs> resist shit. Oh, yeah, without well, because the, he's without crit, the critical damage. he takes six extra, which is minus his three resistance, so three extra. Yeah. So, uh, also, Kiko. Hi, Kiko. Hi, welcome. Um, Hi. Um, as yeah, my one remaining welcome. action, yes. Hanu eyes this thing. And yeah, 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 chuck the head at him. Uh, yeah. N no. That guy. No, not. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna, as my last action, I'm going to cast shield. I hold the head up and a, a shield forms around it. I hold it out as my shield. Okay, it is the immunity thing. Ah, here it is. Okay. Yeah, you're doing it. Dive, it's your turn. You got one more zombie that you know of. Um. Fuck yeah, I want to be cool. Dive, lift, BRB. Sorry, I killed it? Yeah. And speaking words into the void that cannot be heard by anyone, she says the incantation. Memory <laughs> I just cost me. <laughs> I don't have a fucking Maybe clue what you just said. <laughs> I was just, I was just like, is this a JoJo monologue? It's not a JoJo monologue. It is another. Is this a fifth of the North Star monologue? No, it is not. Moonbeam! Hold the uh, hit. Make sure you target. Thank you. Also, impressive voice acting as always. Thank you. That is actually a hit. <laughs> what is that? He is flat footed? <laughs> Dies language setting tripped again. <laughs> She's like Bumblebee. 20! Oh my, wait, why, uh, why did it do damage? Why does it do, ah, uh, uh, fuck. You hit no. the damage button, not the attack button. I hit, 
Oh, this is this is I'm sorry. Sorry, a D20 would have been real nice. Oh, it would. But but no, the dim. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Eshe, it is your right. turn. The second this thing is dead, Eshe's entire body posture changes. She, seeing this thing's head get bloodily ripped from its body by a crazy monkey, makes her relax. But uh, then her eyes fix on, uh, the fellow still standing, which she somewhat forgot about, just like me. I will note and, two things. Uh, One, oh, yes? I think there might be a zombie here as well. Two, I don't believe you can esoteric vulnerability while raging. Uh... Possibly not. Let me check. Uh, you can't do uh, anything with the concentrate trait while raging. Uh, it does not have the concentrate trait. Huh. Neat. Check it out. Wow. It doesn't. That's funny. So, speaking of which, I'm gonna do that. Barbarian Esotericas? Real nice. Yep. I think I actually checked on that before building Eshe and made sure that was the case. <laughs> eh. I mean, it's a fail. You, if it's a fail, you can still use um, personal vo uh, thingy antithesis. Mm -hmm. I don't think that'd be a yep. crit. So, uh, it's, I could use its personal antithesis, right? Yes. Yep, I believe that's Eche 2 plus half is... your level. Mm -hmm. oh. If you'll... What's up? I realize I had an extra turn. If you'll let me get away with it, Eshe will pull the uh, gross captain's identifier from this thing's disgusting dead hands. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Actually, Eshe doesn't think it's disgusting. It's just dead now. Uh, and she will wrap that around her mambele, making sure that it is visible. And if she if she could talk out loud right now, she'd say, I'm the captain now. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. I am the captain now. And she will... I think that counts for a personal weakness. Yeah, sure. And she will walk up, Remember and the target? she's going to try and... Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And she will try and decapitate this motherfucker. Okay. <sighs> you hit! All right. take three and, extra uh... damage. Yep. Wait. Did you say... Hang on, let me read what the hell the personal weakness is. Two plus half your level. Okay, then yeah. Thank you very much. I think that's all your actions. Uh, yep. Yeah, alright. Now it's his turn! Oh my goodness! Sadly, this means the Percival chalk doesn't light up for this one. Uh, notably... He's actually going to stand up this time because Ooh. you're directly next to him. And provoke attack of Funny opportunity. Thing. He's not yeah. that smart. <laughs> yeah, it hit this motherfucker. <laughs> hit! Roll damage. And I believe this will also receive uh, the esoteric plus three. Okay. Okay. So Eshe just, as he gets up, buries her membele, which is a little closer to an axe than a sword, a good chunk of the way into some of his fleshy bits. Oh yeah, you like... Like right into his, like right into his head, 
and you can mm-hmm. feel like his skull crack. If you could push a little harder, you'd get him. But the fact that he's still standing instead. after that, damn. Oh no. Yeah. God damn it. Again, the minimum. <laughs> <laughs> Take eight. I am he... the weirdest combination of lucky and unlucky today. Yeah, right? Yeah, so so he flames But again, himself I on... get double crit during one battle. So, so with, mm-hmm. the, with your axe, your membele embedded in his skull, he flings himself onto you. If you could hear it, you'd need a as it as your axe is full out of his skull as he grabs onto you dealing eight damage and then is going to do something that uh i didn't think i'd be able to do considering you started killing them off very quickly um Mm -hmm. oh it's gonna do the thing (laughs) so Weirdly, I can't tell if this is an attack. I'm okay with you doing it regardless. No, 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 no. He, he'd still get it. He'd still do it. I'm just trying to figure out if he gets the minus five penalty or not. You can ask me. Um, Post the ability? Damage of the, the damage of his attack. Oh, no, I did this wrong. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I did this wrong. Um, Take as much time as you need, beautiful. Would you? Would it still hit you with a minus two? Yes. So it's not a crit. Okay. It's not a crit. So I'll, My bad. I'll recover it, uh, four damage. Yeah. Yes. Yay. Yeah. So my bad. Let me let me roll. That's okay. Let me roll this instead. We'll take the 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 attack, but I'll roll the damage. Oh, so take another four back. Yeah. Oh, okay. So so we're gonna roll the damage. Six in total. Right. Six and seven. Okay. Because, yeah, because it rolls a D four instead of a D eight. Uh, sorry, D six. Uh, and okay. then, and then it's going to use the action. So it flings itself on top of you. This long proboscis like tongue out of its mouth and tries to dig into your flesh as it flings itself on top of you and it begins to burrow into you. Um, the and... only flesh Eshe has on her face is on her face at the moment, but it is able to get into her joints and her mechanics. Yeah, so you watch as it obs- it drinks up something uh, inside of you. And I need you to take the, do- uh, the drained one. All right, I'll do that. Uh, weirdly, Eshe is still not nearly... This is clearly one of the crystal zombies, right? Like, Eshe would have felt that when she embedded an axe in its skull. Yeah, probably. Uh, so, Eshe is clearly not happy, but she is still significantly less bothered by this than she was by the big fellow. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, you do that. Uh, it... Some of its wounds maybe heal. It's kind of hard to tell on a rotting corpse. Mm-hmm. Um, but possible. Smarty? Mm-hmm. Your turn. Alright. And, uh. Uh. Mm-hmm. Where's the other fucker there he is? Stop. Stop down there. What's up first? I'm gonna just get straight up in his face. No raising shields for Right in his face. Yeah, I I was gonna just yeet the hammer, but fuck it, I'm gonna just get right up in his face. Yeah, I'm gonna be real with you. I think if you land a hit, he's dead. Mm. You go Percy! 
all damage? Oh, yeah. How do you want to do this? <laughs> yes. Straight in, just come charging. Do, do, do. <laughs> Shoulder tackle with the shield and then just uppercut with the hammer. Yep, and you literally knock his block off and he <laughs> yeah. falls back dead. Or de dead, dead, uh? Dead. It's a question we with dead. these void zombies. It's unclear. We do, we are aware that there is one more. But at the very there's least, a... there's a body left. Body left. We can mm -hmm. take deal care with of that. that. Yeah. Eshe sighs and uncomfortably rolls her shoulder and cricks her neck. And I assume that her rage will uh, dissipate so, now. Yes. Uh, uh, Eli, I have a question for you. Oh, yes? Are you going to take care of this or are you not going to have time? Uh, I, th I think that you're next in the initiative order, so you'll. I mean, get combat's chance. over. No. Okay, fair. I'm next in the initiative order. So I mean, he's over. before Eshe, but anyway, Eshe will be motioning for Percival to come help her. So, yep. uh, because that takes some time, uh, Monkey probably has a chance. Oh, oh, need a oh no! You need my help. Get on the fucking bed. They are immune to your thing, real quick. Um, Anu is going to go monkey mode and obliterate this corpse. Okay. Uh, he Actually, spell strikes the using thing. the dead zombie's head and bashes uh, this thing skull in. Hang on, let me take care of this. Put that skull down. <laughs> if it's does Hanu have this handled? I assume uh, I do better. I can help. Hanu, make an attack roll. Okay. Um Okay. I, this is I gonna take ten to... minutes. Can you put the token down so that I'm on target? So wait, what's going on? What do we have to do with her? What's the what's the plan, Doctor? I'm gonna treat her wounds. I mean, I could just heal her. Yes, but don't you have limited magic? He is immune yeah. for an hour. What? No, she's, that's too different. She's immune things. to battle medicine. Yeah. Oh, fair enough. Um, Eshe will say. I certainly wouldn't mind uh, Nina taking her time, uh, and it is good to use things that can be used quickly, uh, sparingly, while we have it, um, while we have an opportunity to move slowly. Fuck. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Critical hit. Very... <laughs> That's very uh, interesting. Percy, can you help me move this body over to the vent so that things don't fall in and come attack us? I'm coming. Thank you. So double, double the damage from Claw, and it takes complete damage. Eshe <clears throat> grunts unhappily uh, as it, Nina tries to treat the wounds, and she says... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh? There you go. Oh, okay. Okay. So what happens instead of that? Ah. Uh -huh. And six, two more times. I think... Uh, I'll just... Uh... Wait. I'll just, I'll just figure that out real quick. Um... Yeah, one more time. Yeah, okay. What? Okay, there. Thank you. Snag the ID card thing off of this. I know you also uh, treated. Eshe, Eshe, sorry. Oh, no, okay, Ashe hold on. Pause. 
Yeah, actually, I already grabbed the card. Were you uh, saying, trying to say something to me, Mooney? Yeah, we, we're trying to drag the body over this so that other zombies that are coming together... Use, use it to wedge the hole. That's clever. Right. Good thinking. Alright. Okay. I'm also going to treat myself. Um... Is it, uh, if it's not dead, by the way, I do have one action remaining. I'm going to use to hit it again. Okay. Remember to make it flat-footed, since it's technically prone. Uh. Okay. Uh, click the uh, immunity button. Yep. Yeah, All right. You have your last action. I'm going to hero point that because it's funnier if I do. Okay. Are you kidding me? We do have three in the wings. By one. Uh -huh. I'm so sorry. I uh, can you go use zero point once? Uh, Hardy was making motions of didn't get it, didn't get it, didn't get it. It swipes at you. Huh. Miss this. Let's swipe at you again. Huh. Uh. <laughs> Miss this. <laughs> Hardy and the zombie are dancing. <laughs> that rolling shit for a minute. It's I'm like it's like it's like it's like it's like on the bed still swiping at you, and if like if you backed up, it's probably gonna fall off the bed. <sighs> I'll give you one more turn. I'll give you Hanu one more turn to deal with it. If you don't in combat, I recharge spell strike. This time with my fan and not the uh, disembo disembodied thingy. I am dealing slashing damage because I think you mentioned it having a weakness to that. Also, if you using a mirror for my sword. Yeah. This is with my fan. All right. Yep. Yeah, you hit dead. <laughs> oh, you just like oh, oh, slash, slash, slash. Uh, I will heal that oh, six no. from earlier. Thank you. Oh no. Or. Hanu. He, he does not he, he does not hear you, but he looks back at you for unrelated reasons. Ah, uh, right, right, I forgot, sorry. Uh Eshe will point at the head and then point at the body being moved. Basically saying, put it back. Um, after obliterating this thing, he will he will go drop the head off. Or the more he, since he needs to stand still for Nina to heal him, he will just kind of mm -hmm. float it across I, the I room. I can't hear you. You're immune. I will not take mm -hmm. the six I healed earlier. Hold on, I forgot about that. Ow, my yeah. bones rebreak. Yeah. <laughs> um, Hanu uh, will. Um, Hanu, you watch Hanu reach a hand up. Um. He will just kind of click his jaw and click it back into its closed position. Mm -hmm. And just, he will go back to his normal pog as opposed to murder mode. Mm -hmm. When when uh, Hanu uh, moves the head back over to the body, Eshe nods at him gratefully. And once Nina is done looking over her, actually... Nina, before, thank you for patching me up, but before we, before I get up, could you check on the, uh, area it stuck its appendage into me? Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely. We do know this thing is capable of parasitism. Yes. I'd rather cut that off, uh, nip that in the bud if possible. Mm-hmm. I'm investigating this. Oh, Hatta, you can advance time by 10 minutes if you want. Yep. I believe that would put us at about an hour and 10 minutes, meaning we have about 50 minutes left. Mm-hmm. Uh, actually, I think that puts you at 50 minutes. Uh, that's what I said? No, no, no. 50 minutes have gone by. Oh, uh -huh. okay. My mistake. Thank you. Okay. Ex actually, it, actually, actually, it's actually, exactly 48 minutes. Thank you. 
Because my Actually, treat wounds has been going is lasts an hour. Meaning, oh, since it is clever. still there, I we have twelve minutes yeah. left until an hour has passed, Smiley Face. Yeah. Awesome. Ha 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 ha. Well, actually. So yeah, I um I've been examining Eshe for infection. Basically, you did that thing put any goddamn eggs in me? I have no idea what I want. I rolled medicine. Yeah, you don't know. You don't know what it did. Okay. Eshe is drained. Yeah. Aside from mm. that, though. We do need to get you back to um, to the ship and make sure you get recovered. Not ideal, but... And I'll certainly defer to your expertise, but my understanding of these things is that she gets up off of the bed. If it has parasited something into me, it will be relatively slow acting. Mm-hmm. So, I so, may need to take a break come the next hour, but uh, we can keep going in the meantime. Eshe is going to perform it, quick rites over the three bodies, and she says, I apologize if I somewhat lost my composure. I have a very strong reaction to undead. You can make True. it up to me by letting me loot. I mean, I think it's just that you kind of got the shit beating out of you. <laughs> she sighs and says, if there are any objects that are of clear personal importance, such as religious symbols, leave them. Sure. I like photos of family members. It's kind of weird if we take them. But also, I do believe the purpose of this entire mission for the crew was to uh, bring their culture and their knowledge to a new world. I think the whole process of this mission was to get fuel to fix our fucked ship. Uh, That's yeah, our but, mission. But That's their the mission. current mission. Uh, the Eshe mission. just side-eyes you for a long while and then <sighs> X-gasses in a way that you know she's basically <laughs> admitting it. You are you have a good point, but I don't have to like it. <laughs> uh, Anything we will... find here belongs in a museum. Um, Hanu will speak in the way that he will speak and communicate with the rest of the party to Eshe. I also apologize for losing my composure. I do not know particularly why. However, I do apologize. Okay. That's the ghost. Okay. I've Ooh. noticed that that's something you've been going through. I've dealt with intrusive thoughts all my life, so I can tell you about my techniques for dealing with them. I will be okay. When there is no combat happening, it is fine. Good to know. Thank you. By the way, I'm just real quick going to look at God and be like, hey, if you ever want me to be weird, just just let me know. I'll do it. Mm -hmm. Give me the signal and I'll go off. Give me the weird signal. Dive, if if you believe it's if you believe that it's a good use of your magical abilities, uh, I would appreciate some more healing. Uh, it's <laughs> Yeah, sure, Sorry. I can do that. It's, it's just if we, if we have any other fight, uh, I like, th this is the last of my juice. Can I you, uh, I'll, can I'll you can... throw that, uh, Faith? Yes, I can, although I'm not as good as, at sw as I am at swinging it. And, uh, Percival, what'd you say? I, I mean, it would take me some time. To we had ten minutes focus. earlier that you could have refocused. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. I'll, I'll, yeah, you can I'll, refocus. I'll slap the hands on. Yeah. Uh, Hanu will also mention, as much as I would love to continue moving, I do believe we should return to the ship. 
I mean, it, it doesn't stop us from going back in afterwards. It's not like oh, it's we can absolutely in. come back after we go to the ship. However, it has almost been an hour, and I would like to quickly refill our air supply as well as make sure we get any resources from the medical ward back up to our ship. Nina? Mm-hmm. We should do with the armory and the uh, tool. Um... Those who need to breathe go back to the ship. We will hold down the area until we get back. I do mm -hmm. not believe it is a good idea to leave and split the party. Uh, Personally, oh, I, I, I do not mean here, as in hold down the area. I mean the entrance. Uh, that is more reasonable, yeah, so yes. That would be acceptable. Uh, Isha, did you heal personally? Uh, my understanding is that uh, we're thinking of heading back to the ship right now, and... You still get uh, the six. Yeah. yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. If we are... If we're taking a stop back, then we might as well grab what we can carry. That'll be of use. Yeah. Um, Hannah. Will roll some... We are searching this room. We are searching this room. Zero, does die, does uh, Hanu reach his arms out for Dai as she is going backwards? Or is he, he just level? It's a trust fall in zero gravity. Yeah, it's a trust fall with a very, very light back. This looks like a very interesting gear. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. She's, she's like drifting upside down. She goes, "Well, that was rude." So you you're searching this room? Yes. Mm -hmm. I rolled the secret uh, perception. You need to roll perception. I thought someone just rolled perception. Uh, I uh, zero it. might have. I think that we're all taking the search action right now, mm -hmm. basically. Unless anyone at the very least, we else. are searching the man. I blew my hero point on something silly. Forgot about that. That's funny. Yeah. Actually, um, Eshe, in the meantime, Eshe will roll, uh, roll, uh, Esoteric's lore to make sure that there's a, no part of the haunt that's going to come up our asses while we do this. Good. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. Eh. Oh, I should have rolled that secretly, actually. My bad. Uh-oh. I accidentally I, dragged out my tech magic macro. Notably, I do have dubious knowledge. I, I mean, nothing seems to be happening. Mm -hmm. uh, while you're, while you're exploring, uh, checking out this room, though, you find some, you know, medical supplies. Uh, things that, you know, like, um, uh, gauze and, and other non-perishable things, tools of that nature. We'll probably want to make sure to disinfect all of them, but uh, yeah, definitely good to refill stuff. No, no, no plus one weapons. In a medical bay. Um, is there any detectable magic here? Yeah, Hada, is are any of these medical supplies? Uh, can I write them down on a sheet or something? Or is this nothing? I mean, it's not nothing, but it's medical supplies. It's not like a it's tool story in... something rather than mechanics <laughs> yes. something. Okay. Is it something I can count as resources for something? Yes. Okay. It might that makes it sense. might refill your medic kit, like your medical bags. Do med kit do medical bags have uses? Uh no, but they have upgrades. Okay, I don't know. You find ten gold worth of materials. Cool. Awesome. Thank you very much, dear. I think we have no. a. Um, I'll increase the party the loot gold counts in our treasure. 
Yeah, a party but... loot for air quote materials. Yeah. Is oh. that an appropriate way to handle that? Mm hmm. That's what it's there for, at the very least. Awesome. Anna? What? Uh, is it uh, okay that I increase a gold pieces count in our party loot? I mean, that's, that's the way you were holding the gold cost materials, right? Okay, yeah. I just wanted to make sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Then, is there anywhere we haven't been? Oh, the cafeteria. We should also head to the tools on our way out. We haven't gone to the cafeteria. We haven't gone to the armory. We haven't gone to... We have been to the area. armory, but we haven't spent much time in it. Uh, well, we haven't we been haven't... to the captain's quarters. We haven't been into the cryopod area. We haven't been to the bridge. We are yeah, going that's true. There as soon as uh, everyone comes back. We can hit the cafeteria on our way out, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's head to the, the armory and the tools. Honey was like, you, you all forget <laughs> marching on G Guys! <laughs> guys! God damn it. We took care of all the things. You do we not know that! If that's the case. We took care of all the things. <laughs> Dive just wraps her arms around Hanu and just goes limp and just like. That's why. That's why he he took off after he spawned. We went uh, through down the into ducks. the vents again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now after you saw uh, Nina running off, you chased after her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Shadow! This isn't over. I'm not done. Yeah. It's Absolutely super not, not over. Okay. So Hada, we are going to uh, equally search these rooms. Uh, which rooms? I can't. I literally can't see. Um, here, here. What's left of the armory and the storage room? The uh, God, ah. God left the server for a minute. So, yeah, God has left the server. Um, mm -hmm. so the armory is cleaned out already. There's no ah. weapons or weapons. Makes in here. sense. Uh, any tool in the tool room that could have been used as a weapon, such as pickaxes, shovels, anything like that, have already been taken. Oh, oh fuck. They were dealing with the zombies, so it Anything that is considered a weapon is gone, basically. Yeah, so, but there are things like, you know, bellows, but those are, uh, those might be a little ruined. You'd have to add those up a little bit. Grindstone, yeah, there's probably grindstone there. Things that aren't inherently weapon-like that you could use yeah. as a weapon, oh, they're still around. Are there other, like, materials in here we could count as, uh, scrounging materials for, for building stuff? Uh, let me... Um, also, may I... Uh, also oh, no, feel I free to call for perception checks if you wanna. With... Yeah, but between the five of you, yeah. you one of you is gonna roll something. Yeah. So, this yeah. room's pretty destroyed, and a lot of it's already been cleared out. So you mm -hmm. find like you find a few things that you can like like halves and materials and, mm -hmm. and and things like that. So you can find like a gold worth of materials. Okay, that's a pretty decent amount. Yeah, appreciate that. You are a kind Nothing and inherently GM. useful, but things that you'd have to that you can things we can make into something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you, everyone. Why did he make a big old orange circle? Because I'm detecting magic. Yeah. Oh, no okay. magic. Yeah, Dive has been going around detecting magic. Yes. Dive is the one pinging this campaign. Yeah. Ooh, I don't know how yeah. to do it. Yay. Um, this, this door, was this locked? No. Yes, that's we the way we came through here. That's the, yeah, we came through that way. I believe yeah. this one is just blocked. Yeah. 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 I tried did, to open did it. Do we want to, like, do we want we to, need to We need to go directly Dive! to the ship. Or you're gonna start I didn't do it on purpose. I'm trying to get rid of the fucking sphere. So click uh, on the uh, L-shaped measure tool. On the very left. Okay, so and then, then, then you click there you the go. Oh, that's cool as fuck. Huh? Yeah. 
Yeah, Dive is still hanging on Hanu. Um, Hanu has a cape blowing in the breeze. There is no breeze. We... There is no cape. It's just, it's just Dive. It's okay. just that. Ah. Okay, now that we're here, I'm curious if we could open the way into this corridor. No, we were from turning the to the ship first. No, we'll come we're back. Going to we're going to the ship. Okay, okay. That's you fine. also know from inside the medical bay, there was a lot of stuff up against that door. Yeah. When, when, when we scavenge the, the raw materials of the ship itself, we'll, we'll deal with it. Yeah, we can take our time then, but Eshe is still standing by. For the most part, we deal with the haunts first. Yeah. So, Hatter, real quick. Real quick, everybody. Yes. yes. Or, actually, no, we can't okay. do that because if we face the wall, we'll see things we shouldn't. Never mind. So, so real quick, mm -hmm. I can grab all of you and drag you back to the entrance. But what I wanted, okay. so if y'all, if y'all will stop moving, mm -hmm. there is one piece that I need to be aware of because I am now aware of one of you constantly casting detect magic, mm -hmm. and I, that is. I will not. If you drag us through walls, we will see through those walls. I, I will. Say, in fact, I think this detect magic might actually be level two. It is level two. It is not because it's. I think. Is it not? I swear it, it is. Uh, heightening is you half level, level two spells yet. Half level rounded up. Oh, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. So uh, it is an it is an un, it, innate spell though. So mm -hmm. the you now does it does it tech magic allow you to see through things? Um, no. no. Like not if, through if I, thick walls. I think. Yeah. If if I like drag this out now. Uh, Something which, I, yeah, if I drag it out now, then you'll see that it only covers the areas that I can see, which isn't covered by walls. Also, uh, if it helps, Hanu is using the search exploration activity. Also, and, dive is scouting. And detect magic. No, you're paying. Actually, we'll scout. Oh, yeah, okay. you, if you're detecting magic, that is its own separate thing. Yeah. I understand. Um, also, detect magic doesn't tell where the magic is. Just that Can y'all see that? Can y'all uh, see that square? No. 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 There. There, we see. there we go. Yeah, that is the... There was some kind of magic in that square. Mm -hmm. Wait, where? Oh, I, don't, okay. I, I, don't, I don't see the square. That's... No, oh, that's you square. sense magic oh, in the square... square. And Eshe identifies, all right, that's the cursed area, and will use it, her third stick of chalk all the way up to uh, mark it out, clearly. Okay. So that we're never going to derp into it, because yeah. I'll be honest, I forgot about that. I didn't. Di dive oh, I didn't either. Avoid floor yeah, Dive can't avoid floor effects until she gets to major purse. Mm -hmm. also, I also don't think that's a floor effect. effect. Uh, also, we've dragged a zombie along with. Hey, man! What? Hey, man, how's it going? <laughs> hey, man! Hey, yeah, man! Hey, oh, hey, hey, right. oh, you guys back? Yeah, I follow you guys back to the ship. <laughs> cool, thanks, man. It'd be cool, man. Yeah, we'd like to burst uh -huh, you guys. Man. Oh, no, bro! <laughs> uh, anyway, My mom! Quick... My mom! Anyway, can we have a quick yeah. break? Yeah, sure. Yes. Yeah. Let's use our... <laughs> Oh, turn off my freaking heater. What's that? Turning off my heater. Zero's turning. Yes. Ah. Um, Hanu, Hanu Everyone is get going... food and water if you need it. Yeah, while, while we're taking the break, Hanu is just going to call. A, he's going to get the pull the wire to bring down the pulley and then send up material. Send Smart. up every, all the material and everyone that needs air. Eshe will actually ask if Percival would be okay at being on guard on his own, or if one of the air would be okay at uh, holding guard for a few minutes while Eshe goes up. Well, the you have to wait a few minutes outside anyway for the ship to like come yeah. for the asteroid to finish like rotating you back in place, and then the thing comes down. Um, I imagine we spent ten minutes or so. Uh, I assume like... we wait for the full hour, which would mean my treatment right goes. Back. Yeah. Yep. Okay, see ya, honey. Well, we we did tell her to, like, sync up so we can it's, just go. She syncs up after the first hour. 
Yeah, oh, we yeah, yeah, decided yeah. to do it halvesies. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. So, in that case, uh, we'll wait for exactly 12 minutes. And then she'll be here. Mm -hmm. that, went, that fight went good. There was so yeah, many yeah. more ahead, though. This this was a severe fight. I could see a TPK. Mm -hmm. I could have also seen a TPK, is... in fairness. Eshe is inexplicably a crit magnet. Yeah. No, yeah. it's not inexplicable. You are too AC behind with rage. The, the fair, fair point. Me, for example. Fuck. And Which, Eshe uh... doesn't have the ability to wear heavy armor yet. Which armor? Uh, medium. What is I it? I believe... One How moment. Much dex? My dex is, I believe, not much. Uh, yeah, it's nothing. Okay. And my armor is chainmail. Is that plus four? Oh, uh, let me friggin... Why doesn't it... Okay, yes, it's plus four. Okay, that makes perfect sense. At level three, unless uh, something is decided to be more valuable, Eshe is going to take the ability to wear heavy armor. Yeah. Armor proficiency is a good feat. Especially for Eshe specifically. Mm hmm. Is it okay if I go on a slight tangent and explain what I said to Twitch chat? Uh, go right ahead. So, in Japanese, I will reiterate that I said, Nijibutasu kondaku no monsho, fusu no kiyoki no usawa, waki agari hitaishi, shibure matataki, nemori wo sama tegeru, hakusuru tetsu no ojo, taizu chikazuru do no ningyo, ketsu go seyo, hanpatu seyo, chinimichi ono, uh, onore no, murioku wo shire. And in English, that means seeping crest of turpidity, arrogant vessel of lunacy, boil forth and deny, grow numb and flicker, disrupt sleep. Chronic queen of iron, eternal self destructive goal of mud, unite, repulse, fill the soil, and know your own powerlessness. And that is Hado number 90, Kurihitsugi, from the anime Bleach. Mm -hmm. um, me and my friend, uh, we we have this like uh inside joke where if, if one of us is just like chatting shit to each other if like if someone's performing really badly in overwatch uh it just goes you're talking mad shit for someone in you but that's a god that can range amazing so we we both we both learn the incantation nerd <laughs> <laughs> I will post a GIF. Don't take that as an insult. I think that's very impressive, but it is also an entire heap of words. It is. Those are definitely words. It is a big black box of fuck you. That's what it's meant to be. I posted the GIF of what it's meant to look like. Ah, excellent. And I will also link the GIF in the thingy. Anyone that has watched the Bleach anime, uh, I will try not to spoil it. But it is a big black box of so fuck you. Um, anyone who hasn't watched Bleach, don't worry about the big fox man. I don't know what his deal is either. For me, he is just sort of there. I've never seen Bleach, but uh, the main thing I know about it is that uh, people weren't happy with it. I, I remember some people not being happy with it. I think the thing that I was annoyed about is that one of the arcs that I really liked was... The anime was really rushed, I believe. Ah. Uh. The, the, um, basically, the, the arc going on right now, after a literal 10-year hiatus, 
It's I was about years. to say, wait, it's ha it's still going? Yeah, yeah. They oh, took God. a 10 year hiatus. Yeah. So it was the Fullbringer arc and then 10 years of nothing. And now we're on the Thousand Year Blood War arc. But the Fullbringer arc was made whilst the whilst the manga was still being made because they like caught up. So it mm -hmm. ended up with the the show being really really rushed and like not dragging it out as, as long as it, it could be, and like a, it, it just felt really really short. Mm -hmm. So some of the characters didn't get a lot of character development. I still really the like. The only thing I know about it is that. Uh butterflies and is a thing yes butterflies and <laughs> god yeah that, that... i don't know what that is just that it's a thing and people didn't like it oh really okay well um i i was the very in... least my one friend who uh watched bleach didn't like it uh, well that's just like an in-between form of eisen going from regular guy to perfect being um Okay, and so it's up, like halfway up the uh by Shonen line. Yeah. Let me let me because um he does it twice. Uh and the actual incantation is when he looks like a butterfly. Let me check to, let me let me post the actual video. Also spoilers for bleach. <laughs> mm-hmm. I personally don't have a problem with that. I'm back. Okay. Hello, honey. I went on a tangent about Bleach. Uh-oh. It's one of the few, like, big shonen animes that are still going. Mm, mm. Like, one of the last, I think, honestly, now that One Piece of all things is also coming to an end. All things must end eventually. To be honest, I didn't think it went on past the Thousand Year Blood War arc. I mean, when something goes on a ten year hiatus, you usually assume that it's not going to start again. Mm. It's like, I, I knew that the manga was still going on, but I didn't know that... Um, uh, I mean, I yeah, I, I didn't know that the manga was still going on. I, I knew that the anime was going to continue to catch up with the manga. Oh, yeah. Uh, are we all back? No. I am present. D I don't okay. know about everyone else. I am, yeah. That makes sense, I was muted. So, here okay, Connor. Yeah. Um, can you advance the time in game for exactly twelve minutes? Done. That is, that is an entire a full hour we've been on the state the meteor. And the ship is here, and my treat wounds is finally wore off. Excellent. Great. Then when we get back to the ship, I can check you for, uh, for, you know, poisoning in your lungs and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'd switch over to the the uh, the map, but you know that. You know, that might, yeah, you're thanks. gonna leave it very quickly. Switch. So, yeah. So, yeah. um, go ahead and make me another medicine check. Cool. Uh, how 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 much is left of Dyer's treat wounds? Does Dyer treat wounds? No. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I have Mooney. I have you. I oh, know. Yeah. Click yeah, your token, and in the top right, how much time is left on your treat wounds timer? Oh, seven rounds. Okay, so it's oh. it's over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So just okay. right-click so, the effect. I have. So, 
yeah, uh, we get back to the ship. I'm going to spend 10 minutes looking over Hanu and Dive. Uh, just checking their lungs, see if like anything was wrong with their like breathing apparatuses. We're going to get new ones to so get those refilled while I do that. And then we head back. You so you're not going to give one? us another hour-long wait and make us unable to be healed by checking our lungs, are you? Uh, yeah, yeah. I want you to form. Oh, you, you're going to heal us. To, sorry. Yeah. That's what I'm you mean. I'm going to heal you to full. That's what I mean. <laughs> sorry. Dive is full. I'd rather just have the... Well, if we're going to stay here now, we might as well. Oh, uh, well, I can do... We're not going to stay here now, but it is still a good idea to heal the full. Percival, Percival can heal you. Who needs hands? That is true. Uh, I, I'm I... missing... Four health. No, three health. Okay, Percival can heal uh, Dive. I'll, I'll treat Hanu. Is that okay, uh, Zero? Yeah. You may treat okay. me. Cool. cool. I'm going to treat you. Oh, no. Nina, you got to be my super sexy nurse lady. Ah, uh, how good. Oh. Man, I'll heal exactly oh. four. Thanks. I took damage. <laughs> ah, you stabbed me! These hands are E for everyone. Okay, I'm good. I got it. I fixed it. Okay. And Percival will, will have another lay on hands, actually. So Percival can also treat anyone with another lay on hands. We can get those hands given to everybody. These yeah. hands. Mooney, I think you misspelled everyone's name in chat. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Huh? Oh, I get it. You misspelled everyone's <laughs> name? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I am a bisexual disaster. I agree. I'm, I am uh, projecting. There we go. That's the word. I don't know what manner of disaster Eshe is. Uh, do we want to give that that six extra possible healing to Eshe? Whoever wants it, take it. I, would say I give certainly it to Eshe. wouldn't mind that. Mainly because she's yeah, the so... one who tends to get crit by everything. Yeah, yeah I don't know what that's about. <laughs> I do want. To it's called having low AC. I yeah. also have stabilize. That does that's not a good help one. in this situation, but it is good to have. Wait, did I already did I already get the six HP? Uh, I don't know. You did, but you can get another one. Yeah. yeah okay. Just because Eshe had higher HP than I anticipated. The the beauty of Percival is that he can give you hands more than once. Yeah. Eshe is clearly doing better, though. She does briefly come onto the ship with you all specifically so she can mix a bunch of salt water and pour it into her wound uh, where she got proboscis Yeah. So make me a medicine check to figure out what the fuck that's about. Eshe or someone else? Uh, Nina. Okay. Now that you're, you know, in a more less hostile environment. Shit, mm -hmm. I should have rolled that secret name. Uh, we have some hero points in the pool. Do you want to use one? Uh, I don't know. We have three. It is a little cheap since we know what you roll. <laughs> you don't know. I would say we have three Thanks points. My dice. Points. What's up? I'm okay with you. I'm okay with you using the hero point. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll reduce it from the counter. So I'll grab a hero point. Thank you. I have consumed it. That's more like there it. There you go. F 22. Five. So, it seems that uh, after using the, the, the tongue attack, um, the, uh, the void zombie can uh, drink, in this case, blood. Uh, it's drink blood, but yeah, it's, it's meant to be, you know, 
Yeah, yeah, whatever the fuck we have. Uh, yeah, um, that heals them, and uh, the creatures drained one until hmm. they receive any amount of healing. Oh, so drained oh, gone. So she's not drained one anymore. Drained's gone. Yes. Okay. Um, cool. But yes, so that can. In that can, case, she uh, would have regained one more HP. Yeah, that can. Uh, that can. You know, become a bit of a problem. Mm. Yeah. It's a kind ability to have that it doesn't stay forever. But it most likely uh, didn't put anything inside of me. Not that you can tell. In fact, no, uh, but you you should keep around some of that salt water, though. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, it's going to bring the salt water with her since she inexplicably it, it always has it. It would be strange if the adolescent version, the infantile version of the creature would be able oh, to somehow right, put right. the baby, you know, another infantile... They're still in chest buster form? Yes. Well, they're a little bit past chest bu burster, but yeah. They're they're somewhere in that zone. They're not mm -hmm. adults. Got it. Uh, Hannah, can you advance time by ten more minutes? Can do. Still, I don't feel like it's a bad decision to be safe and to uh, salt my wounds a little. Mm-hmm. That sounds like a bad idea, and anything up with it. It's just salt in the wound. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing we don't feel pain away. Oh, oh, we do. I would like to quickly deny this claim of not feeling pain. <laughs> you know, maybe I'm just built different. I've never experienced a piece of pain in my life. Uh, maybe you just, just like it worse. Maybe you should just get it. Just, maybe you just kind of suck a little bit, you know? Yeah. Maybe you, you should try, get good. Try Bob here, just maybe you should get I good. Try not feeling pain. Okay. So we're back onto the uh, asteroid. Okay. Uh, let's let's check out the cafeteria and then go to the captain's scores and stuff like that. Uh, Di Dive says to, to Angel, man, I, I bet you wish you could have like come with us to like get some hands-on experience if you had a body you could totally like come with us on adventures like these do you require additional assistance i need hmm. do you need a more detailed report on the on materials that i request oh yes she'll give you more detailed Report on the no more detailed report. No, on, on the... don't give it to me. Give it, give it to someone smart. She like... will give a more detailed report to Hanu, who she gave yeah, the was... original report to. <laughs> to I like Hanu. the, I like the idea that Hanu is just getting ready to go down the thing, and he's, and he just, his eyes light up. Message received. <laughs> I mean, uh, I know it's already. I'm, I'm Hanu... request from deep dive. <laughs> Hanu gets like a beep boop. Uh, Hanu downloads the report, and it's like report one. Because yeah, report it's a parentheses one. <laughs> <laughs> I need to keep track of my data. No, 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 no. Report one brackets the number one end bracket, so you're aware. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <sighs> I like the idea that report. nobody else is as internally linked with the ship as Hanu is. That Hanu straight up receives emails from Angel. So, so, uh, so cool. we can, we can flavor report. that if you want. But the way I've always been like telling you is like, Angel goes, "Hey Hanu, you have a message, and you have to go to the computer and to find the the thing." Fair. I, that I, makes... like, I like Zero's idea. I also like the idea of uh, Dive having literally none of that because she is just like broken and she can't receive messages from Angel. Ashe is she, she's very... Also voice, so she doesn't need to receive messages from Angel. She can send messages to Angel but she can't receive messages from Angel. Ashe is very uncomfortable and uncertain in her robot body and she uh, she's a very physical robot generally being a combat droid and being a combat droid also made to be very self-sufficient, so she has no idea how to do what the fuck you're all doing. Nope. Hee <laughs> hee, androids are better. <laughs> the hell did this is? Nina! We're starting to walk off again, which is uh, not what we need. 
Yep. Because we need to stick to the original plan. So of do you want you want you want to go through? Do you want to get up and squeeze through the this section and make it to the other side? We uh, yeah. We want to go in through. Check the no. Oh, bah, ha, ha. we want to check these areas out we, and then go in. Rescue, um, then loot. Yeah, Eshe Eshe will say. We I know for now at least for now. Y'all did agree to check the cafeteria real quick when we came back. Yes, yeah. but I thought that we were going to do that on the way out. Yeah, but now we're going to do it on the way in, since we yeah. know that's the way in. Yeah, to be fair, if we do it on the way in, then that means we can get to the way, the place that we were easier. Ashe will accept this. But she will still say... We won't be doing any serious looting until we've dealt with the, the haunts. Sir. Yo, is that a fucking flashing light? That's sick. That's so rad. What are you going to do? Uh, yeah, that's a flashing light. Uh, Very ig cool. Ignore the flashing light. Oh. Okay. Had to get rid of it. That's okay. I can't. I can't get rid of it. Oh, you can. You it's just gone. did. Ashe. Not to me. It's still there. Weird. We know. It's gone for us. Eshe, uh, seeing the body's size and gestures for Percival to help her out. Yep. And we uh, do the choppy choppy neck thing. I'm gonna also help. Yeah. So there's. So I'm. Uh, here's the thing. The, the the this hallway is really fucked up. So you like squeezing through. Um. You know what? Everyone, make me a. Uh, make me a reflex save. Oh, fucking uh oh! Not the the check to squeeze. Yes. Okay. Is this magical? Yes. Squeeze. No. Oof. Oof. Well. Thank you, honey. You <laughs> to no one's surprise, the tanks suck at doing dex work. To no one's surprise, the monkeys are monkeys. Honey, I think you knocked my dice into a worse position. Because, like, I, I, I got you a seventeen. I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I, I got you a 17 and you knocked my die away and I got a fucking shit number. At least you didn't get a one. Mm-hmm. Oh. Um, oh. Who knows? Uh, who, who be the hey, DC of the team? use your hero point? <laughs> oh, if it's a DC. Or one of the communal ones. I'll, I'll be alright. Are you Fair sure one? about that? I believe that only the monkeys beat. That's fine. And Percival crit failed. Yeah. Uh, it's taking its time. Oh, wait, there you go. All right, everyone who failed, take four. Everyone who crit failed, take eight. Uh, what happens? Everyone... As you as you're trying to like, this like whole wall here is just like blown the fuck out, um. And so as you're trying to like squeeze through it, bits of it are like scraping and cutting and slashing against you as you move by. What's the DC? I think I said twelve. The uh, thirteen. Thirteen. Okay. Cool. We take nothing. Monkeys are fine. Monkeys yeah. crit pass. Hell yeah. Well. yeah. Yeah, yeah. If you if you pass, you take half. If you crit failed, you take double. If you critical pass, you take nothing. Mm -hmm. okay. Looks like you take four, Mooney. Um, I have, yeah. Once we're through, then we do. The oh next wait, copy. no, Mooney. You take one. I take two. Oh, I take one. Oh, I, I am. It's like two plus copy. half your level, ain't it? Uh. Yeah. The, 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 Okay, I do have the squeeze action. You gain resistance equal to two plus half your level. So all yeah, physical you take attack. one damage due to your resistance to physical. I mean, like I said before, it is honestly just a skill diff. I'm just so much better than you all at everything. You know? Anu does a cartwheel. Oh, uh, 
so uh, this would take uh, probably two minutes. Since some people got stuck. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll advance time when I get the chance. Okay. Um, we, we do some head choppies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, do well, you pin them down first? Yeah. Yes. I help. Okay. Okay. Some zombies die. One of them wakes up! But they're pinned <laughs> to the ground, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm, I'm so sad you went back to the cafeteria. Fuck! I'm... <laughs> Um, while, while they're chopping some heads off, can I clear this door? Sure. Because I think it's a door we've Sorry, already been babe. through. Like, we've been over no, here. No, you haven't. Have, we've been I can see it. You've been, all the door, you've been onto the other side, the yes, door. but you haven't been through that door. Well, yeah, that's what I mean. I'm like, I, I clear it so that we have a shortcut. Back to Appreciate an area it. we've already been. God damn it, walls. And if I remember right, this door here needed captain permission, didn't it? No. Nope. It was above, this door. Above. It was this oh. door. This door needs captain permission. No. no, 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 no. The so Ellen, that's the medical door. You, yeah. you, you mean it these was the doors captain's door? Ah. Yeah, it was this door that needed. And I believe this one is blocked, so you need to go yep. over here. Yeah. I think you killed. Those, those behind you. Um, yeah, I think you've uh, killed that one already, too. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to keep track of the loca the places that you've been. I yeah. appreciate it, honey. I know that can't be easy. have not been here. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Um, SJ does have the permissions. Uh... I think that Eshe uh, actually gave the thing to... Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, we never will have commissions. No, Eshe Sorry. gave it to Percival, so Percival it. will oh, be the yeah, end Percival goes first. Yeah, 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 yeah. so I, was, I unlocked it and I was trying to relock it, and I'm, I'm so sorry. Um, it's okay, yes. honey. So you, you, Percival, you, you come up and you kind of, like, wave the... Oh, hang on, let me just... Uh... Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you, you use the you use the captain's credentials, and there's a mechanical, physical click, a very heavy thunk, and the door becomes unlocked. Ah. Okay. First things first, before anything happens, that's going to detect magic on the room. Smart. Detect magic to find the spooks. You detect this door. Mm. This door immediately pings for you. The Ooh. door is magic. Okay. Good to know. First of all, do you know a room clear? It's where you badge in and sweep the whole area. That sounds like a way to get jumped. What no. we're going, to, what we're going to do before that is. Uh, and Eshe will gently like switch places with Percival. We don't have to do that right now. Yeah, but uh, you just it just Eshe, shifts to the side so you can get a view on the room. Eshe knocks on the door and and uh says air quotes aloud uh, uh as well as writing on the door jam. We politely request entry into uh, uh, into the area uh, entry to the spirits uh, who want this area and she will crunch up half of her chalk uh, uh, stick toss it and toss it in and see if anything happens nothing seems to happen she will gesture to allow Percival in but say be cautious. Uh, we know that uh, the most likely locust of multiple haunts is beneath this area. Mm -hmm. Hold. Hey, Mooney, do you mind reading the um the the tone? Uh, 
do not know if your spirit resides in here, but we've come to rescue. How's gonna, this uh, looking? I'm going to... Okay. Escher. Okay. Okay. Yes. I was wondering who was going to do it. Escher, as you step up next to this door... Because you, I, it looked like you, you were all intending on this body here. Yeah, yeah but I, I did not zombie. think that one through. Yeah, I'm you, just you going towards the center of the room. Yeah, well, yeah, you go into the center, of the center of the room, the zombie, the body, they're all on the same spot. Uh, and you're like, oh yes, we should check the zombie. Escher, you out of the corner of your eye, you swear you see a face, and you turn to look at the door. And almost as if the door itself is made of some kind of plastine surface, a face is pressed from the other side towards you. Uh, you can see the, the, the pushing of a hand coming out, and it attempts to grab you. All right. Um, My sound, she got big fucking. Mm-hmm. Uh oh. I'd re refresh okay. Foundry uh, as well. We, we, we're doing this again, are we? Looks like everybody's Foundry crashed. <laughs> it's okay. Mm -hmm. First time in two hours. A long while. Yeah. 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 And my everything hasn't exploded. I take this as an absolute win. Oh, yeah, yeah absolutely. What so I actually need. What's muted? Nothing. We did stop uh, to be muted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey. hey. That was so not my fault. Every, every, every mistake yeah. once, you won't do it again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Percival, Eshe, and Nina, I need you to all make me will saves. Yeah, okay. Uh, huh? Hatter, if you're already in, could you make the will save for me? Of course. Yeah, Thank you, dear. Just got in and I already have to refresh again. They stepped Ooh. in the bug box. Yep. Uh, uh, sorry about that, everyone. That's on me for not being careful. Mm -hmm. Hanu, who is not going ahead because I'm Someone was going sorry. to do it. I was just waiting to see who. The power of hey. being back here. <laughs> huh? Hell yeah. High five. Yeah. Hanu is the smartest of us. Yeah. This is technically mechanically not true, but however, it is true. That's not a bad save, person. Right. What's my casting modifier? Hold up. So, Charisma. Charisma. Uh, is, <laughs> I can't remember with Pathfinder 2. Is it if you've met the DC you passed? Yes. yes. Okay. In that case, as, as this face... Ah, uh, the power of the DM who loves traps. It's not traps, uh, the haunts, but eh, close. Uh, the face contorts and twists into this agonizing scream of a man you don't recognize. But the, fa the, the features are kind of smoothed out from the this, like, plastine effect across... Uh, <laughs> uh, this plastine effect across its features, its hand reaching out, it's and his hand reaching far farther than it should attempts to grab at Eshe and Percival. But it's terrifying to look at uh, Eshe and uh, Nina. You're able to kind of steal your resolve. But Percival, you weren't, you walked in here not involved with the wall at all. You weren't even involved with the zombie. You were just coming into the center of the room. So you look and you just see this horrifying feature and you are frightened with how much? Frightened one. Okay. Hey, Percival, do you still have that frightened thing? I do not have the aura of courage. Uh, oh, well. Sadly. We'll get that later. I'll get that uh, later. I, I had it, and then, you know, we went down, so... Uh... Eshe will gently push Percival back and take a step away, and she says, My apologies, I should have heeded my own advice. Uh... uh... You, you say that, except I need you to move back. Oh, okay. Uh, so, please ignore what this looks like. Okay. You know what? Hold on. I'm just gonna use... Uh, what do I fucking use for this? Um... Uh... 
The rock. Hanu is default dancing in the background. <laughs> yeah, rock. Oh dear. Again. Not again. Uh, I and I need. No, it, it, that's not actually necessarily it. It's yeah, it's not it. I'm just, it's a placeholder. Yeah, it's so, a placeholder. Rock. Haunts even better. Yes. Um. Oh, the there's a good. thing still in the combat tracker. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> <laughs> That's beset. That's all right. Oh shit! Are we in, are we in initiative time? Roll initiative. Yep. Okay, that I'm gonna just roll initiative because there was no reason for me to be stealthing. Hold on. Speaking of no reason for me to be stealthing, I set my initiative to stealth because it was there last time. Well, I know who's not going first. Sorry, Ellen. I know who is not going first! Sorry! <laughs> I rolled a fucking two. Oof. It's the random zombie. Yay! I rolled a fucking two. What? Uh... He has a plus eleven! I'm sorry, dear. Is it all right if I say that Eshe still has her Mendele drawn? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a totally fair to say that all of you still have your weapons drawn. Okay. I am the weapon. Hell yeah. Watch out. I have a knife. <laughs> die. Die. <laughs> I roll like shit. I also roll oh, like so, shit. For, for, for Shadow. For Shadow. Uh, Pathfinder 2 has this very unique mechanic where the thing that you're doing just before initiative is the thing that you roll for. So even mm -hmm. if your perception, which is what you roll for initiative in this game, isn't that high, if you're sneaking and your stealth is very high, you roll stealth instead. And this thing doesn't have great perception, but it has great uh, stealth. Which, yeah. uh, mm -hmm. So it's rolling stealth. Um, in fact, does it even? I don't even think it has a bonus to perception in the first place. No, it doesn't. It doesn't even have a bonus to perception. Yeah. <laughs> in what world do you use crafting for initiative? Me! Uh, if you are in the middle of making something and you get surprised. It's... No, actually, that's perception. <laughs> if you throw I... your hammers at someone? So, I would imagine if, like, if you're, like, hey, I sp I'm, I'm building, like, a big, like, I'm building a barricade. Trigger. Yeah, I'm building a barricade, and it starts combat with you, like, physically, like, working on the thing. I would argue that's crafting. But that's a very specific... That's very specific. You can also do non-combat encounters, so there might be a yeah. crafting encounter. Yes. Yeah. Um, Pathfinder 2 does, in fact, have social encounters. That yeah. is true. Um, okay. So, uh... So... Uh, this wall bulges out with the shape of a howling humanoid face as it twists and forms tendrils reaching out to nearby creatures. Um, it doesn't go first, unfortunately. I'm sorry, So, Eshe, this to... is a haunt. Go the fuck ahead. I believe with a haunt, uh, you're allowed to use Esoterica to get rid of it. And yeah, so, you can uh, do it even if you're only trained. I have haunt ingenuity. But we'll yeah, get to that. Post that. Yeah, so yeah, I would post that to... just to see. This is an encounter for Eshe. Yep. Post but please, feel free to interact. However, Eshe is going to be kind of bossy here, and if I'm being too much, it, please say. Well, it's your turn, uh, so you do your At vote. any rate. Go, Eshe. Uh, as two actions, probably, Eshe is going to... Uh, if the uh, if Smarty will allow it, gently push Percival back and enter his space instead. That's okay. fine. All right, mm -hmm. and I imagine that's two actions. So, as her third action, now that she's at least closer to out of arm's reach of it, she will crouch on the ground, take out yet another piece of chalk, and roll it towards it. I had ten pieces of chalk. I'm using them all, <laughs> and see um, if it reacts as she writes down upside down so it can read it easily. Uh, 
we mean you no harm. It is still going for you. Like, it's still, like, reaching towards you. And with its, like, weird tendrils that are growing that almost, like, hands, like, trying to desperately, you know, stretch out of this, like, weird slime, like, like, you know, putting your hand through something, uh, it still seems to be reaching you, and it's incredibly long. This is oh, happening shit. in a matter of seconds. You get it. And I'm gonna give this to you. It has a 10-foot reach. Okay, good to know. Eshe will say, keep your distance from it. Uh, I'd prefer if we didn't engage just yet. Uh, so, Eli, and, can I make a suggestion? Yes. This might be a time to roll lore as a Terica to learn what you need to do to make uh, it go away. Do I have any actions left? So you you like pushing back and stepping into um Yeah, like Percival's uh, willing. Yeah, if Percival's willing and is also like, yeah, I'll take a step back on my turn, then yeah, that's like one action. It's fine. Okay, so one action for chalk, one action for push, and yes, good thinking, Zero. I am going to use my next action to my last action to uh basically roll esoteric's lore for lore this haunt. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I will roll it blindly, because that's what I'm supposed to do. Yep. The DC is easier, because this is a lore check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, what's the DC for a level 2 thing? I should be on its section. But I can also look it up for you. Please look it up. It doesn't because it doesn't say about the information itself because this isn't a feature. Uh, yeah. Um, How, it, what's, its, uh, two. what's its rarity? Uh, it doesn't have that either. Okay. Uh, it's not a creature. Sixteen. Yeah. Oh. Right. Um, is that with specific or non-specific? Uh, what do you mean? Because uh, you'll uh roll. This is a non-specific or... lore. Oh. Non yeah, okay. Then it should be uh, one step easier. So uh, minus two to the DC. That that actually gives it to you then, because otherwise you failed. So, yes, Excellent. because it's esoteric law and you know specifically about Hunt, you have to, there are three things you have to do. So there are three things you can do to help dis to disable. Disable, not stop it. If you disable, it'll reset within... Uh, one day. Some amount of time. Yeah, within one day. Uh, Disabling it should at least give us more time to work on a way to stop it. Yeah, disabling it is 24 hours. You, If you're still able to come back within one day, um, to stop it entirely, you have to remove the body from wherever it is housed. Mm -hmm. um, that being said, you need to either make a small occultism check to do a small little like one-action ritual to p weaken it. Uh, mm -hmm. You need to physically push the face back into the wall. Or you need to somehow communicate with it. it. It says talk, but that's in this case you can't really do that. You have to communicate yeah. with it using diplomacy to talk it down. You need two Eshe, successes to be able to disable it. Eshe Does it say what level is... trained expert master? Um, trained in all of them, but I know esoterica basically means that it doesn't matter. No, no, well, no. For, for Eshe only, if we do yeah, for Eshe only. only. But all the oh. other ones are trained. You have to be trained in occultism, mm -hmm. athletics, or diplomacy. Oh, it, it does actually matter for this, because hard ingenuity that just says, like, if you are trained, you are treated as if you're a master. Yes. So you still have to be trained. But in all of... Oh, you still have to be trained. Yeah. Oh, interesting. All right. Yeah. So, I am occult trained in occultism, however. Okay. I, I have occultism? Yeah, occultism, athletics, and diplomacy. Actually, and is it okay to mix and match those? You have to, yes, you have to make two successes out of those three skills. Yeah. Okay, Eshe will draw a quick little <laughs> diagram on the ground. It's not super good, but it is understandable of, like, uh, basically communicate either... She draws a little picture of Percival pushing it in with his shield, and then of Percival talking with it, and then of uh, the monk the monkeys and I, uh, uh, the monkeys and dive drawing like sigils in front of it. 
So yeah, would okay. this be yeah, you a, tell, you tell, if you were you trained in... Yeah. Sorry. Are you trained in Nicolaism? Or... I would say, if you're trained in diplomacy, this feels like you could be used diplomacy here, Eli. Uh, yeah. I could, except, but I've done Except that would be your third action. Yeah, you already had a well, no, that, As the I, action I, to draw on the ground with chalk. Yeah. yeah you're not well, just I drawing... I would have had to get out the chalk. I'm trained in diplomacy. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. trained in diplomacy. You have to draw the chalk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Personal and Dive can also help. We can uh, all help. Also, yeah, instead of I... talking to the ghost, alternatively... <laughs> <laughs> there's, no, uh, there's no wrong answer here, honestly. Yeah. Uh, but it is Dive's turn. You yeah. can fight it. You can fight it. That is a thing you can do. It has health, mm -hmm. it has AC, it all has all that. Because it's going but... to attempt to fight you until you placate it. Yeah. Eshe has recommended these three options, and for the record, anyone who wants to can steal Eshe's chalk. And and this thing is to disable it for 24 hours? Yes. Uh, okay. Yes, disabling it does it for 24 hours. Uh, and then if we get rid of the body and, like, take the haunt down at its source, it, things will chill. Yeah. I think all haunts are, like, if you take care of its source, it stops. Probably. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So... I'm sorry, I was away, I was grabbing a pillow. Um, what, what was the three options? Uh, occultism, uh, athletics, and diplomacy. What? Occultism to basically use sigils to demanifest it, athletics to shove its face back into the door, and uh, diplomacy to talk it down. And or we are allowed to make it talk match. it down? Yeah, of course, talk. Yeah. yeah, you have to communicate with it somehow. Um, probably it would be best, uh, and more, most in character for Dive, to use the cultism. Because I feel like if she tries to talk it down, it would not go well. She but might end up irritating it. But Dive like, loves talking. Dive loves talking, but Dive knows that talking gets her in trouble, so she's not going to. I mean, you are a charisma-based character. You probably really go to diplomacy. Yeah. I, I, oh, actually. Now, yeah, notably, yeah, you I, don't know what the DCs are. No. Good point. But... Uh, I, I have a plus four in occultism, a plus eight in diplomacy. Dive is going to go talk to the ghost. Yeah. yeah. You did this uh, last time, also. You talked with the ghost. Oh, you're doing this. If you... If you want, you can steal because that on your shit. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Um, Dive uh, wants to go and not walk in to the range of the, the fear curse thing. Stay behind me, Dive. Yes. Yes. It's on your shoulders. If you end up using the chalk, yes. you could probably write on the walls and have it be air quotes visible for the ghost. And if you know sign, you might be able to use that. Oh, I did give uh, you my writing kit. Yeah, Dive's gonna gonna write as she talks. <sighs> if you have message, you could use that too, probably. I don't have message. Message, I believe, is a first level, is it? In this? No, it is a cantrip. Message is a cantrip. Ah, I do not have that either way. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I do. Um, Dive is going to... What should Dive say? Would you just say that we're, like, here to help? How, how do you um, think Dive uh, could talk this little dude down? Yeah, that's it. That's your choice. It's a spooky ghost. There's a face in the wall. Yeah, there's a wall face. It has spooky tentacles and it's trying to reach out. Hmm. How do you normally talk to ghosts? Funnily enough, I don't! Hey demons, it's me, <laughs> your boy. If you've yeah, but... been paying attention to Eshe, and you do not have to have been, you've noticed that she's been very polite, deferential, and very much uh, doing her best to let them control the conversation, such as it is. Ugh, that sounds boring. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes. I figured. Be done about it. Anu continues um... to default dance in the background. Hey, 
we got your uh, the the ship. Don't worry, God isn't here right now. You can fumble. Uh... I'm just imagining Hanu doing the Pennywise bean dance. <laughs> oh, God. Not what I was referring to, but still funny. Hanu hitting the green. I know the default dance is a specific thing. I don't know what it is. I know it's Fortnite, but I don't know what it is. I mean, honestly, that would probably be what I would do. Like, um, just the style on the demon. Style on the ghost. Sorry about that. I'm back. So, what's going on? Styling on the ghost would be more of a, an intimidation role. <laughs> Styling on the ghost. <laughs> uh, challenge it to a Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy style limbo competition. <laughs> <laughs> and then if it if you if it loses, it has to become your friend, best friend forever. Yeah. Um... The Grim Adventures. I, I think of Billy I've just go. Don't worry. We're here to help. We are going to to end everyone's suffering. You want me to plumsy? Blind? Yes, please. Don't know. Don't know if I'd have phrased it like that, but. Come. I have oh. a hero point if if I'm able to reroll. I'll tell you this, you wrote pretty good. I'm not going to tell you if you passed or not, because I think you have to actually use a hero point before you know if you passed, but you wrote good. I'm not going to use a hero point. Let me tell you this, on the die, you wrote above a 10. Nice. That's good. And you have a plus, so, like, 8 or something, so... Yeah. You don't know what the DC is. Um, the... You're not sure if the haunt understands you... But maybe it did. Because again, you have to make two successful checks yeah. between those three skills. So, it's not but entirely placated help, if you succeeded. But to help, but in, in order for us to help you and to help all of you, you need to get out of our way. Hey, uh, I think you have an action left if you want. Yes. Do you want me to make another diplomacy check? Um, you can, but by the way of the wording, I'm going to say that only one diplomacy check, will, only one successful diplomacy check will work. So if you succeeded, it's just going to be you talking to it more. Mm -hmm. If you failed, you have another so, chance. Yeah, if you failed, you have no chance. It's up to you. Yeah, no, it's, it's just talking to it more. Okay. Um, there's no reason for me not to. By the way, Smarty, do you still have infectious enthusiasm? No. Fuck. Yeah, no. All the, all of my good support things have just gone poof. Alright, Percival, it is your turn. As this thing is writhing like like fucking Freddy Cougar from uh, in the wall from the from the first movie. The only Freddy Krueger movie I've seen is Freddy vs. Jason. It was a good movie. I wish you could watch it. Hi, <laughs> Jenza. Mm. Well, ideally, I'd like to not be frightened anymore. I mean, we'll go away at the end of your turn. Freddy yeah. vs. Jason. It's exactly what it says on the tin. Yeah, pretty I, much. I, it, Halloween is coming up soon. I uh, I'm gonna watch Freddy vs Jason again because it's a great film. I'm also gonna watch Willy's Wonderland again because it's also a great film. Watch <laughs> Willy's Wonderland. It's a great. Film. Willy's Wonderland was great. It's, it's a weird, bizarre, like parody of FNAF with the main character being uh, Nicholas Cage. Nicholas yeah. Cage, who doesn't have a single line the entire uh, he doesn't movie. doesn't speak at all throughout the whole movie. It's marvelous. What a... What a... Okay, so what are you doing? Sorry. No, it's, uh, no, it's um, totally fine. 
as I know we will go on if we will go on a fucking tangent, yeah. Yeah. Um I know I've also got a fairly decent diplomacy. Yeah. You can also just hit it with a hammer. Cool. Yeah, yeah, you can just attack it. The other options are cultism or athletics. Well, my cultism is uh, terrible. Yep. And you and do need to be trained to do those skill actions. Yeah, you have to be trained. Yeah, so uh, that just leaves the Do you have athletics? Because, uh, yes, but not trained. Fair enough. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. You can just hit it if you want. I could, but that's not that's not the what he's going to do. Because this is a rescue mission, and this is clearly the target that needs rescuing. Or to the is, rescue is the thing that needs, so he's going to, I'm going to diplomacy with no. Inspire it with a heroic tale. Yes. Does the play Volume. reach out with message and maybe get a ping from it? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. Any, any, like, any way to, like, communicate with this thing out loud? Yes, I will reach out with message as I, uh, mm -hmm. And roll diplomacy. Blindly. Blindly, yes. And the quick uh, one for that is uh, control shift while clicking on the Already button. done it. Alright. Alright. You try talking to it. Again, um, again, this writhing mass pushing against the door um, doesn't seem to be affected by the diplomacy uh, the same as Rai, uh, as Dives. You don't know if they've succeeded or not. Um, uh, but if they have succeeded, you only need one more success. So The main point is just trying to get the point across that they're here for a rescue mission. Please allow us passage. Yeah, yeah. Is that all you can do? Um, um, so... You can also ready an aid. Uh, oh, will... yeah, you could do that. Yes, I will do that. Actually, what's your fortitude DC? Fortitude plus ten. Fortitude by the plus way. your D ten, yeah. Pretty dang good. Eighteen. Jesus right. Christ! It its tendril reaches out towards you almost slowly and then suddenly with blinding speed and it wraps around your head and you are immediately like you immediately feel the sensation like like around your like upper arms and then around your head and you immediately get the feel the sensation of being crushed and the claustrophobia of being of being in a, such a tight space um and Plus fucking 14. Um, yeah, athletics. Plus 14 athletics. Oh, motherfucker trying to uh, grapple. Yep, that's what it does. It's, you are now grappled. And then... Because I think the only other person is Nina. What is your fortitude save? Uh, fortitude DC. Oh, hell yeah. My fortitude DC is 14. Uh, unless in that one's... Joke. <laughs> Got real fucking close, also, though. Yeah, we have, yeah, and the other one shoots out extra long. It's it's strange because it looks like it almost looks like it has the an elbow. It almost looks like it has a, a hand in its wrist, but it's unreasonably long and bendy. Um, and it wraps you up both, and then it's last action. Wait, I know. this is a grapple. It's a yeah. grapple. Oh my god, you can get them. Be free. Yeah. <laughs> uh, who do you want to free? Yeah, because um, you can only get one of them. I will get Ashe because that's the one that happened first. She's okay, the one who knows right. the most. Yeah, that's true. Ashe uh, will. Scoot it just like here. it worm starts to worm its well, way you have towards to, um, and then lashes out. I believe. I, can, I believe it's not ready, ready this time. time. I believe you, it's you, like, you had to make an escape. Make oh, yeah. oh, my yeah. mistake. Sorry. Thank yeah. you. Escape um, is unarmed attack, 
athletics or acrobatics. Yep. All right. Uh, I'm pretty sure my unarmed attack would be the best of those, but uh, let me check. Eep, boop. Yeah, unarmed and athletics are equal, so... Roll, damn you. And this is supposed to sit grapple DC. Which is 10 plus it's athletics? Mm -hmm. So, no. No, unfortunately not. You yeah. try to bap it away, uh, but it, it refuses and continues and wraps you up uh, as its last action. Um, it will can start to constrict you. One or both of us? Both. It says it, it uh, sorry, it says that it squeezes each creature that it has grabbed. Ah. So. Both of you take eight damage as it begins to compress you in on on yourself. No same? Um nope. No no it's uh, it's like an uh an, ooh hold on. Does it give a save? A basic save or something. It's okay if not. No it doesn't say it says uh, squeezes each creature to grab dealing one D four plus one D ten plus four damage. Okay. I'll take damage. Uh Eshte is visibly shocked and in pain but still holds out her arm with her Bembele uh, parallel to the ground and in a weak grip, uh, communicating don't start fighting it now. Oh, Ashe, you do know, though, that you can do those, make those rolls in the middle of fighting it. Yes, uh, yes, that's fine. Yeah, alright. So, it does that, it starts squeezing, you can, like, you can't hear it, but you can almost feel the, 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 um, the plates in your body is beginning to pop. The the rivets and the screws and the fasteners beginning to groan and com and complain as you're being forcibly squeezed together. I cannot see because and crash again. Who's next? It's uh, on. It is on. Uh, Hanu. Go ahead. Oh, I crashed as well. I could make that last check if you want, Hanu. Oh, I um, got it. Okay. You sure? I have some yes. great modifiers on those checks. I do as well. Ouch. Yes, greed center. Hanu. Uh, really? Hanu, Hanu spends one action running up. Uh, do you mind switching it to my turn? I, I literally, like I said, my thing crashed. Oh, sorry. Hold on. I think I'm back. There, okay. Cool. So Hani moves over here, it's one action. Hatter, I will I would like to try some I would like to use I do I don't think I have a way to never mind. I was gonna try and bullshit something, but I can't think of a way to bullshit it. Okay. Do you have any of the skills? What do you I have to? like two of the three. And um diplomacy and athletics? No, athletics and the cult. Why would I not have occultism? I'm literally cursed, remember? That's uh, what do you what do you run to? Um here I'm moving. Uh, I was start at the door and I moved where I am now. God damn it. Oh actually, you know what? Move. Hold on. I would move here. The funny thing is this thing still doesn't have a tactical opportunity. Oh I know. It's not that's not the thing I'm worried about. No, no, yeah, yeah, but I just think it's funny. It's like, yeah, it gets two uh, grapple attempts, which, by the way, do not take the minus five penalty for attacking multiple times. Holy shit. Yeah, it says that straight up. You do not take the minus, the, the multiple attack penalty. Uh, but it has no attack of up to It's like, all right. At least I'm not restrained, so I can still take manipulate actions. But I still have two... Yeah, you just grapple. So Hanu nope. is going to do something he shouldn't do first... As he runs up, you all see the thing happen, where his jaw unhinges. Because of course it does, and he's going to try and push this face into the wall. Go ahead. Athletics. I'm gonna make it blind roll. Um... Please do. 
you put your hand on the face as it's the open mouth silent scream. You start trying to push and push, but the low gravity of of the asteroid is making it tough because you're pushing against something that has way more resistance than you. So as you're pushing, the gravity is almost like pushing you back. It's like trying to push something heavy in water. And so um, you're trying, trying. It just can't, can't can still hate really. On no, he didn't spend an action preparing. Yes, he did. Did he? Vessel spent an action, and he had an action left to step. Fair enough. Um, real quick, let me let me finish my turn first. As Hanu is pushing, and it doesn't seem to be working, he begins to his mouth begins to move. As it's jaw is unhinged the mo the motions of his mouth seem to move slightly better as he begins to chant silent occult prayers to try and calm the spirit i will roll occultism this time also secret yes i'm gonna pretend i will begin good. chanting you begin chanting do you want to pretend that you roll good or do you want to re attempt to re-roll I'm gonna pretend I did good since I don't have any hero points of my own. Okay. You begin chanting. But the bloodlust is strong. You've never been in this mode without the innate. Hey everybody, of do carnage. you mind if I borrow one of our group hero points real quick? Oh for it. Cool. <laughs> I'm, do I have I I'm have a, no I, mind. I have a turn also. We, it, we can start okay. that on turn two. Okay, I won't do it then. Ow. The inherent bloodlust. You've never been in this mode without without it. And it it Honey alters... feels weird. This thing doesn't have fucking blood. Yeah, it but it alters words words in this occult language that are very similar but require very you know, exact pronunciation to mean different things begin to blend into each other. Think words of like meaning, words of uh, meanings of like of calm and peace shifting slightly to to words that are not those things. And you do not seem to placate the spirit. Well, that's my turn. I'm sorry. You're fine. Nina. Uh, Nina's being grabbed. Yes. <clears throat> uh, Nina is going to... Uh, to... Um, look at what, what everyone else is doing. She is going to... figure. What if I... What if I shot this face in the face? <laughs> hmm. Okay. So I'm gonna make a knowledge check real yep. quick. Yep. Oh, in fairness, this is yep. your investigation, so you do get to do this for free. Yeah. You so, what you looking for? You rolled occultism, not. This is a knowledge check. Oh. I get a free one of those. Is this a crit? 26? Recall. Uh, because of the, because it's occultism, no. Ah, oh, shit. What, 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 what other skill could I use? Oh, no, no, I'm sorry. Actually, be, uh, actually, yes, yes. Because occultism would be 16. So, yes, it is a crit. Hell yeah. Alright, what do you want to okay. know? Um, okay. So, uh, I would like to know... Oh, uh, real quick. Uh, first of all, you're still frightened. Uh, uh, oh, does it not go away at the end of your turn? It does not go away until the hunt ends. Fuck. What is it? Was it? What is its weakness? With its weakest uh, like defense. And I get an additional bit of knowledge, and then I'll let you determine what that is. 
So, um, reflex. Reflex is its worst. Reflex. Okay. Yep. Um. So it still is counted as an object. Okay. Even in this state, so it has you know, so it has particular immunities that an object would have. Okay. Does it also have because what does it have hardness? Because it is also an object I'll state it, yes. Yeah. It is also hardness. Okay. You don't know how much that hardness is, but it has hardness. Okay. So what else would you like to do? Uh is that my knowledge? My two pieces or my one an extra on critical success. So how many pieces would you normally get? Um, on the core knowledge, I would normally get, uh, a, uh, the, the piece of information and then an, and a crit, I get additional information. So yeah, that's the additional information. Okay. One is that it's reflexes well save and then two, that it is still an object, uh, and it has hardness. Okay. So uh, I'm going to share that with everyone. And I'm going to say, because I critically succeeded on this, I also kind of figure out, because Nina isn't, like, she's not a hot expert like Eshe is. She's yeah. not cursed like Hanu is. She's not magic like Dive is. And she's not a hero like Percival is. But she doesn't know how to figure things out. So she has been watching everyone else, and she's figured out, okay, this is the things I could try to do. Um, and she is going to see what would happen if I shot this thing in the face. <laughs> and then she shot go, the thing in the face. It'd go real fucking well. <laughs> is that a critical? That's a critical. Okay. She shoots the thing in the face. Jesus fucking Christ! You you you, you hear you see the mouthing of Jesus fucking Christ. You pull out your pistol. No, oh, no, my short bow. So, sorry, your short bow. Sorry, yes, your short bow. Yeah. You pull it out. Fire. The weird gravity on this asteroid definitely like kind of like fucking around with your range. But with this close, it doesn't that ma it doesn't matter. And it it hits the metal briefly and it reflects off but the reflect is actually important because then it goes into the break between the two the two doorways and lodges itself in the mechanism that opens it um and uh deals significant damage though not nearly as much as you would expect yeah you don't deal like you deal 22 damage holy shit yeah. but you don't deal all of that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Hanu is standing here trying to push this face into a wall, and then a fucking arrow hits, like hits the wall. It's like, ah! Get out of my way, Hanu! Nina, Hanu, not that looking. Face... You cannot hear you. Yeah, the face, right? Nina, an expert in athletics, ah, mm -hmm. uh, is going to. Try to while grappled. Well, she can't move. Fuck. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Now she's gonna she's gonna imitate everyone else. Do I get my um in uh, my um investigation bonus on this for uh occult uh rituals? I don't think so. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Make it secret, by the way. Yes. She's going to attempt to do some cool bullshit. Okay. So, you begin chanting. And again, this is like, it's in space. Yeah. You, the words, even though you can speak, mm -hmm. the words, there's no, it can't come out. Mm -hmm. Right? So, you begin chanting. And you are able to more focus on the the, the, the feelings and the meanings of the words. But mm -hmm. as you do so, the tendril, you know, tightens a little bit more because of, 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 over your upper upper part, upper like arms mm -hmm. and around your face, and so it like constricts around your face a little more, making it 
making it hard. You can't, and you start, you start, you keep, you keep going with it, but it, it just keeps restricting. And then suddenly, suddenly, you, it's less about the words and more about the, the intention. And you are able to keep calm, unlike, unfortunately, unlike Hanu, who he is in that state of like, of bloodlust. Who yeah. wants to fight? You're mm -hmm. able to keep calm, and you the ritual requires that, mm -hmm. and you suddenly can breathe again as the tendrils into the wall, and the face recedes and it's gone. Nina prepares to aid uh, Asher. Congratulations, you're not twenty. Oh my God! Fuck. <laughs> Oh yeah. Fucking luck. Okay. Uh and by the way, also uh for for dive, you success you succeeded on your your first diplomacy check. Hell yeah. I assume Hanu so, rolled like shit. Uh you rolled uh you rolled a three. <laughs> Sorry, no, you rolled a four. You rolled a four. A four and then a three? Like what was the order oh, of operation? Oh yeah. Oh no, sorry, the order of operation because you re-rolled. You originally rolled a two. Oh no, I rolled a two and then a three on my two different checks. You can end the encounter, by yeah, the way. Yeah, so for, for on athletics, you rolled a two, and then on occultism, you rolled a four. <laughs> Dive goes I am trying! Dive so goes over to Hanu and bonks him on the head. Fucking like silly monkey. Um, I did! Hanu, Hanu goes to, like, defend himself, and then he stops. He reaches a hand up and he clicks his jaw back into place. He then puts his hand back up, like, Hold on a minute! Uh, don't forget Ooh. to end the encounter, by the way. Right, yes. Thank you. I forget that I have to do that. Okay. Wow. Damn, this this uh, ghost thing is more difficult than I thought. Hmm. Look, I fought the instinct to stab it. Yeah, but Hanu, Hanu, your instincts sometimes, they're just right. I still greatly appreciate it. That Wait. I don't even know what happened. It seemed to just piss off after Nina shot it in the face. Yeah, I think it just pissed off. I thought I shot it in the face. Do Wait, I'm preparing that... to aid uh, Escher. Escher. <laughs> That oh. is possible, and you can fight spirits. I simply prefer not to. Hanu, real quick, Hanu points at Percival. He then points mm -hmm. over here, like, I need some guitars. Yep. Let's pin and stab. Pin and stab, you do it. Mm -hmm. It's fine. So what Hanu does is uh, pin, he undoes his arm to get his fan out, doesn't even open the fan, plunges the closed fan into this thing's neck, and then opens the fan. Oof. I love that. He then folds. By the way, this, his, his arm flips to put it away. This thing had a uh, uh, hardness of nine. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. As base, I probably to be thinking about like how doable the ship is. I made a game of bonuses, but uh, no, like hardness nine is basically like, yeah, that crit dealt almost half. That Ooh. was the spirit of the claustrophobia of being locked into a wall or some other unpleasant unpleasant area during your death. Yeah. Which means that of the haunts we're aware of, we're still dealing with the cold spot that is the haunt that comes from freezing to death. Mm -hmm. Weirdly yeah. enough, weirdly enough, the cult yes. spot never specifies where, like, it's it's more of just like spirits, kind of like, yeah, fucking with you. It doesn't have to be specifically oh, someone fair. freezing to death. The the wall or one, death. the entombed spirit, does specify that it usually comes from mm -hmm. uh, a murder victim entombed in a wall before or after the death. Or at least that's a that's a stereotype of the cult spots doesn't necessarily need to be true. I'm currently what, what assuming... Is true, then? When you're dealing with something like haunts, true and false are more... 
suggestions. Mm. You have flexible, you have... flexible than they are with the physical and the real. Mm. Every death is different, and every it's, grief is different. It's like dealing with uh, with with people. Like if you get a testimony, that stuff, like you don't know if it's true. You just gotta go with what you uh, what your gut tells you. That's not a terrible comparison, honestly. Yeah. What's what we know of that still remains is the cold heart and the whiskers. Yeah. I believe that the nexus of the cold spot may be located underneath the area we noticed it, but Clever. I, that's what I figured, but I don't have any theories about the whispers, and there is a decent chance that there are other haunts also around. Whatever way we go, we do know that the area beneath is where the majority of the haunting will be. Do we want to take a break, or, like, it uh, looks like Hanu found some cool machinery. I would prefer to keep going, but I wouldn't mind ten minutes to uh, do a little recovery. Mm -hmm. First um, of all, have you had a time to, like, do your hero thing? That thing where these you... These hands! <laughs> <laughs> For the record, uh, I, I don't you... technically think you you had a point uh, to do that because we went we, we spent it pretty soon and we didn't have 10 minutes for you to refocus I mean, it said I had the point so. we had time on the um, ship to refocus and stuff yeah yeah but we did spend that on healing no we? okay that's fair so who's getting the sex? Who's getting it? Uh, I have 13 HP. Esche has a uh, 15, so we'll give it to Nina. I shall heal. Um, can I ask why Hanu is like crammed up in a corner of one of the machines? <laughs> yeah, Hanu, uh, did you find He's not crammed. Cool? He's crawling along it like a spider. Mm -hmm. uh, because this is Spider the monkey. machine that's broken in our ship. This half of the cryo it generator. Is. Yeah. It is. One of the many machines that are broken on our ship. <laughs> Maybe we can find replacement parts. For the record, yeah. this is something I should have mentioned earlier, but all of you, don't be ashamed if you wind up in a state of fear. The fear of death is the deepest, most primal fear there is. And that is what haunts are made of. Mm -hmm. They're um, made of the, the emotions that people feel when they die. Don't be afraid of being scared. If you die, you'll turn into a spooky ghost. A uh, hatter. Ignoring That's spooky ghost context. What I was communicating, but... That's fine. Uh, hey, hatter. I'll make sure to let you know you're alive. That's yes, sir. Um, with this 16, not the, my best roll, but it's not bad. Um, can I under, can I, looking through and climbing around this little area, can I understand why the cryo broke? Like, why the cryo malfunctioned? In, on your ship or in here? In here, because we remember, the video said that the cry, the uh, ivory beds fucked up. Yes, so this is more of a, um, so this is not all of the things. Oh, With this, fuck, I should do an autopsy on the doctor. So you, you, uh, the other half would be like in the actual ivy bed itself. This is like, yes. the, you know, processing. This, this is the, what pumps the, the liquid nitrogen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, um, of a 16. With all the damage that occurred from the crash, it's hard to tell. Hmm. That's fair. Hmm. 
And it also may not have been from here. It may have been... I mean, sure. Okay. I'm gonna aid here. Uh-huh. Um, part of my lead. Nah. Nah. So okay. close. Yeah. Uh, now, notably, for some reason on this map, it, they didn't show up. But there are supposed to be two trapdoors on either side of this on this of this stairwell. Mm -hmm. Uh, for some reason they didn't show up on this map. I don't know why, but they are there. Hmm. Oh, Do we know okay. if if we still get feared if we stand in like the circle or whatever? No, the the fear goes away once the the once the, the you placated the thing, so it's gone. <sighs> okay. It'll come back in twenty four hours. Um, at which point it'll try to make that will save on you again if you're in range. Mm. Uh, Hondi would like to kind of. Hondi will stop, point at Percival and at Shay to be like, "Come here." <laughs> He's like, "Hold on, I'll, I'll, I wait a second. Uh, and after he makes sure those two are here, he's going to try and pry open one of these doodads. So actually, that hard. Uh, actually, it is hard. You start trying to pry open the doodads, and you realize it's locked from the other side. Ashe mm -hmm. will stop you for a moment, and uh, but when she realizes it's locked and we're not necessarily going to get through it easily, she uh, she puts her chalk away. Is this door closed? Yeah, you should. Uh, y yes, but you can open it. Okay. The, so you like lift up the thing and it's like it comes up a little bit like and then it like stops like something is like pinned in there keeping it from being opened anymore. Yeah, something like an arrow. Yeah. No, no, no. I mean the, the trap doors. Oh, okay. The, uh, the big door to the stairwell is... You can just open it. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> when, when we're all prepared, I'm ready to head down. Move slowly, though. Mm -hmm. I know this is difficult for some of you. But do your best. Why was no, it's, it's easy for me. You said that. Now I'm drawn back to that medic corpse. Please stay with us for the time being. I will. And once everyone's ready, Eshi will start heading down with Percival at her side. Uh, well, <sighs> while going down the stairs, Hani was like tapping the side of his head like, Hey, head. He's he's speaking in his own head. He'd be like, "Hey, head, keep fucking in line. <laughs> keep in line, shit. jackass. <laughs> Stop with the bloodlust. That thing didn't I have blood. I get everything else. That thing didn't have blood to spill. Not happy. Big map. There you go. <sighs> Good thing every room has two exits. Mm -hmm. Redundancies. So you this door that this door that leads to the ivory beds that you know is just like the entire like ceiling is just fucking caved in. Yes, however, mm -hmm. It is open enough that I can see. Yeah. What you looking be for? Be cautious Honey? around doors. Uh, it seems that a lot of people died of uh, asphyxiation or trapped in their pods, uh, and um, we'd do well to be aware that there might be more of those types of spirits. Do you think it would be a good idea for me to throw a dance and lights in there? Not a terrible uh, one. Maybe not yet. Uh, however, All right. Hatter, Hanu is looking at the visible, like, because these things are wired up and all secure. He's looking to see how the, po like, the closest pod he can see, how that looks. So I didn't really do this one because you like you weren't supposed to get like really good vision on these but like I didn't do it on the other ones either. Um you 
they seem fucked up. Like, but it's hard to tell if that's from the crash or if that's from something else. That is entirely reasonable and entirely infuriating. Um, Hanu, Hanu, like, peering through any cracks he can see through is like, it's hard to tell anything about the pods because they are broken from the crash as well as beforehand. Yeah. Do you smell any oh, weird was... things with with your nose? Does anyone have a no good nose? Air. Scent does not travel through space. Yeah, well, yes, it. Okay, no, there's no AI it doesn't air. very much. At any rate, I'd hoped we'd be able to move towards the cobalt first, since we have a, a decent idea of where that's likely to be. But unfortunately. I mean... If we go up and around, here should be where the AI room is. Oh yeah, I wanted to get there. Do you feel like that would be a good use of our time before entering the belly of the beast, I suppose? Yes. Uh, well, for all we know that they could be in there. That's true. Well, it could also be... Like a little safe zone that we can go to. I trust your judgment. Uh, let's check on that, but do allow me to announce us before we open the door. Mm. With a haunt, you don't want to surprise it. Mm -hmm. I imagine are... with most haunts, it only knows you're there. There's that, but also, these are creatures... Uh, creatures. I, these are beings of uh, survival desires and uh, base emotions uh, and such things don't react well to being startled. Okay. Go ahead. Alright. Uh, I imagine we're heading back upstairs. Is that my understanding? No. no. What? There's oh, a door okay. in front of us. Yeah. So Around. Okay. Sorry, I thought that we were going to the AI area, like, up above the captain's quarters. No, no, we're going, what? like, around, because, like, the, like, up here is where it. the, the actual AI core is. As you step and... into this room, mm -hmm. what should be the storage uh, area, uh, though it does seem in massive disarray and, 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 and some damage, it's not as damaged as the other areas. It seems relatively, uh, Seem relatively well protected. However, um, the boxes are stacked up um, high up, and you can see, weirdly enough, those are barricades. Wooden barricades. Those are punji sticks. Along slightly like weaker parts of the boxes where they they didn't quite set up. Oh, this must be where they held out in face of uh, all those uh, critters that made zombies out of them. Hey, everybody! At the very least, there was something on the other side of this that they didn't want getting through. Hey, everybody, I have a working theory fine. that I'm not exactly happy about right now. Uh... What? What's that? Well, you see, I found it very interesting that not only did we deal with these green-rocked parasites, but so mm. did this crew. We got ours from the dragons. However, thinking about it, I think we're seeing the first wave of the entities of Spava. My working theory, at least. Spava? The I... parasites. It's a theory. Okay. We should I won't rule that out, and I, and I think that's a good idea to, for something to keep your mind on. But I do think that... Uh, there's at least just as good a case uh, 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 that they are just parasites. Uh, well, maybe the dragon uh, were the entities of Spava, and these are their weapons. No, I feel like the dragons would have killed us if they were. So I, I want I want to clear, clear something up too, real quick. Um, although you can like see through this section, it this 
yeah, yeah. This box is supposed to be like really high up. Uh, it's open uh, to like represent that you can climb up this and try to get over this, but it's pretty tall. So it we doesn't can't see over it. You can't see over, and it doesn't seem the most stable. Mm -hmm. So dive to it. Mm -hmm. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, that is very light. Dive and the monkeys could probably do it, but the problem is one of your tanks is the one who knows shit about horns. <laughs> Okay, so down here is a dead end. Should we check that out first? It's not a dead end. There is a door. Well, there's a door up into the kitchen, which is outside, so we already know where that is. The walls and you know that trapdoor is pretty well... And you know that, that trapdoor in the, in the kitchen is pretty much fucked. Yeah. Could so I'm not sure you can make it down here, up there. Could, yeah. you, could you detect magic on that? Uh, Mm -hmm. Oh, what one? The dead end. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, thanks. She, like, <laughs> jumps off and, like, lands on Sir Percival's shoulders and then jumps off. So, um, Hatter, we're not so supposed to be able to see over this? You're not supposed to be able to. It's 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 there to represent that you can technically climb up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So... Your emanation will stop at this door. You don't need to get any magic. Beyond That's it, you don't know. <coughs> uh, real quick. Right. I am using the search exploration activity. So my okay. passive perception is being used to observe for things around. And Esha is always considered to be searching for haunts. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. I, so. I'm investigating. Yeah. Oh, you're investigating? Yeah. Okay. I have the best Hanu, roll me perception, and Nina, roll me the thing to investigate, and do not uh, make it make it. Okay. Uh, what uh, skill am I investigating with? What can you argue? Yeah, what can you argue? What are you looking um, for? Cultism, society, uh, medicine, Akana. Underworld law? Roll me. Underworld continues you know what? to be yes. criminals. Yes, underworld law. No, hold Hell on. Hell yeah. Law. Yeah, roll it. Woo! Okay. I must clarify that underworld continues to mean criminal I, activity. I, I, criminals. No, I'm aware. I'm 100% aware. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Nina, it strikes you as strange that if this was built to fend off the zombies, mm -hmm. that although there are signs of combat, mm -hmm. There are no bodies. Yeah. There's no blood. Mm hmm The signs of combat. You can see, like, swords and kind of arrows. Is there a fucking not, coup? Oh. Not, there, there aren't arrows, but there are definitely, like, oh, this this hole is where the arrow got were hit, and then someone pulled it out. Oh, there's arrow uh, tips and broken arrows. Yeah, yeah, things like that. Um, Was there the a fucking coup? Some, uh, mm hmm. Uh, but there's no blood. There's no bodies. It's strange. Huh. Someone's cleaned up after themselves. Okay. I, cer I certainly think a mutiny is possible. Oh after my all, God. when it rains, it tends to pour. I'd also have to think. They well, aren't supposed to be I awake. Think... I can understand them having to deal with the fact that they're going to be traveling through space for long enough that they're likely going to die is enough reason for them to go, hey, oh, this is fucked. Why shouldn't we have the ship? That's one issue. Can you... Can I want to check out this door. Do you want to go first? Wait, did I get anything on the uh, detect magic? You don't detect any. No. Not out here. Not out here. With the no magic detected, I don't believe it's likely there will be, uh, well, not anything uh, relevant to our haunts uh, visible to us, but I trust Grab under the door. detective. Uh, Grind knocks, it open. Knocks on the door, writes on it, grinds it open. This room, uh, once held holding the, the pots, pans, and other main accessories that are not necessarily food for the kitchen... Is in massive distance. Hold on. And pots, they're all destroyed. And you see 
crushed underneath some heavy shelving units. Is a Wait. Bottom. Why isn't that frozen? Oh, yeah, ignore that. I'm sure. sorry. Yeah, ignore okay. that. Sorry. I'm sorry. I fucked up. I fucked up. Don't. <laughs> Okay, uh, Hanu was about to have a freak out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I do. You do know something interesting, though. Directly next to it, almost like almost in a tan, but not quite, is a dagger. Actually, will gesture for. Uh, uh, do not dance. dance. No, 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 no. It doesn't look like a cultural artifact. It just looks like. A plain everyday dagger, like not even like a I'm gonna stab people dagger, but like a almost more of a knife than a dagger. Detect yeah, yeah. It, 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 Dive is whatever. Actually, up. reaches over and just it kind of grabs Dive in a headlock and says, "Detect if... magic first. Uh, fine. Do I detect magic. You don't see anything. Ha! No magic. Also, you... You do see that this wall here mm. is missing. It's not destroyed. It's missing. Interesting. Eshe will I'm gonna say, see if it's the zombie. Somebody's already done a good job of pinning this fellow down. But so I would still... their head's pretty well crushed. Alright. Dive, dive takes a knife. Then, so rather it's, it's... than sorry, go rather ahead. than trying to re-decapitate it, Eshe will simply begin the rites. Yeah, so it's it's bigger than a knife, but it's smaller than a dagger. It could definitely be used as a weapon, but it doesn't seem to be like that. It wasn't inherent in its inherent uh, intention. She is wielding a kitchen knife right now. Anything essentially, done. yes, that's a kitchen knife, but it's a particularly large one. You know those yeah. like those carving no, no. like meat carving knives that people no, no, have. No, no. It's like one of those. Dive, dive is literally wielding a kitchen knife right now. Oh, okay. What do you have? Uh, a knife? No, a knife. no. Literally. <laughs> but yeah, this this it almost there is some damage around the edge, uh, but they look like tool marks, not damage you would expect from the ship. This panel has been removed. Wait a minute. These over here. What are these? Uh, pots, pans, things like that. Or oh, you do mean this? Yeah, those. Um, they look like smashed up bits of metal, but it also looks like they've been purposely placed there. They look like gems. Gems? Crystals? Like they're crystal. like pikes. Yeah, oh, no, no, no. They're like long. They're supposed to be wood, but I we call them to be metal. Uh, nice. like broken pieces that someone has taken and like made a makeshift barricade underneath the trapdoor from the kitchen. Okay. So I'm just gonna go over this way and look at this wall. No tool marks. Uh, huh? No tool marks on the inside. Oh, there's another another uh hall. This leads behind the barricade. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you step in, you step in, and you're like, yeah, these they're the tool marks. I want to move this panel from the inside. Hanu, Hanu puts a hand to his chin. This was used to get around the barricade. I think there might have been a civil war going on. Or well, the, like I said, a coup. There's the zombies upstairs, but... He was wielding a weapon. A weapon, air quotes. And they had barricades with punji sticks set up. Something about that mm. is defensible. This looks like a way to get around the defenses of the enemy. Who cleaned up then? What do you what do you mean by cleaned up? Cleaned up the bodies that should be around if something was gonna happen to the war. Yeah. The winner. Well, they didn't win for very long, clearly. So she here's the thing. Place. Here's the thing. If no one died, there's no need for it to be cleaned up. Mm -hmm. But if there was zombies, why would they not die? Because they would just keep throwing themselves at the Well, zombies could design. not have pulled a panel off the wall with tools I from the inside. It, I was never involved in probably. Wait, the tools enough, are from so... the inside? On the inside. The tool marks are on the inside. Someone who moved his panel. From the inside. 
Oh, oh, no. Somebody was trying to get out. Okay, okay. clarify. Somebody was hang running. On, hang on, honey. Which inside? Yeah, which inside? Was it the inside. vents inside or the room inside? From from inside this vent, someone okay. removed this wall panel. Oh, no, no, I no, think no. that was what Zero was assuming in the first place. Oh, no. Somebody was running. Somebody tried to... She tried. Hmm. Okay. Everyone, we the, need to move forward. Why is the... Why is the trap door barricaded then? Stop the, the the zombies from getting in, I'm guessing. Yeah. Why would someone have run towards information? the zombies? Yes. Uh, in uh, possible if, quest. Uh, yes, I was going to suggest that one of us might go for scout, but if that's not the plan, then it, Percival. I mean, I can get scout out. Yeah. Also, you can you be behind Percival before. if you desire. Because okay. we say this before, Hanu, uh, you you take note of there's a ventilation system along this wall. Yep. In, in on your ship. Hanu Good takes note know. that he is going to be the worst. <laughs> monkey, 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 monkey. Wait, 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 wait. I wanna, I wanna do, I wanna scout. Yeah, let let dive get ahead and do a little sneaky why, sneak. Why, why, why can't I not scout? The 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 module isn't updated yet. Uh, well, you just say to Hannah that you scout and then you do it. Okay, what is scouting? Uh, plus uh, one to initiative. Okay. okay. But uh, I was thinking not... in more the in character sense, though. Uh, pushed your pushed your scout archetype. I saw him dead. I was thinking more in the sense of she sneaks ahead and sees what's in front of us. We're actually scouting. Yeah. Oh. Um... Sorry, I should have clarified that. Oh, you get to do that even if you don't use the scout activity. Excellent. So you can go around pinging. Uh, or you can sneak ahead and do an actual scouting. Right. Okay, this time wanna... Hanu is... Um, does somebody who has better perception than me, who isn't dive, mind searching... I have a six, so... Uh, I can search. Eh. Okay. okay. I'm at an eight. I am going to stealth. I'm going to be in the back of the party. Hanu is hiding in the vents. Actually, uh, I will essentially just be keeping her eyes open for uh, haunt shit. So I'm okay. guessing Dive's going in first? Yep. Uh, yeah, that's my understanding. Watch and you'll be... You'll go, like, a little bit ahead of us, uh, before she steps into this room, she's going to ping it to detect magic. You cast detect magic? Uh, you it's don't... centered on you. That's fine. You thing? don't know yeah. this anything. Uh. Okay. So the dive's going to go out. Yeah. You step out. Now, notably, from this side, this wall looks like it's been forcibly removed from this side of the vent, from the outside of the vent. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, your process of elimination. Someone trying to get in and around the barricade. Yeah, so from process of some process, uh, it started here and moved, and moved through the vent from where you came. So, you know, so someone from this side of the barricade trying to get to the other side. Can we uh, pass the in-game time law? Oh, sure. How much? Uh, um, let's say 10 minutes. This seems yeah. like this has been 10 minutes. We, we, we've been exploring for 10 minutes. Hold on. It. Percival, could you help me out with these? Yep. Percival and Ashe take care of business. Ah, I'm going to yep. pretend like I don't see space. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, actually. No, should I detect zombies? Apparently, uh, yeah, basically. Weirdly enough, you can see through, like, weirdly, for some reason, you're able to see straight up see through a wall for no apparent reason. I don't know why. Uh, That's okay, honey. Sorry it, about that. It's like weirdly, yeah, it's weirdly like, yeah, there's a wall here. They can see through it. What the fuck? Yeah. All right. Um, you start taking care of bodies. One I person... do attempt to detect zombies first. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um,. Weirdly, these don't appear to be zombies. Ah, okay. If 
if she determines that they're not zombies, Eshe will actually stop beheading them mm -hmm. and will instead um she'll scatter a bunch of like various she'll turn these boxes into like makeshift more beds mm -hmm. and then scatter a bunch of crap around them so that if these bodies try to get up for some reason uh they'll make wait shit uh scatter some sharp crap around them so at least they'll have a heat beat. Mm -hmm. And uh, she will give the rights. You find this gentleman here. The, he has like makeshift armor on. And he has a sword. Nina, what? you yes. find on his person. Yeah. What appears to be <gasps> a letter. A letter? Ooh. It's old. It's incredibly old. You can tell that. But... Mm -hmm. It hasn't had the chance to decay because it's been in the void of space. Yeah. But you're still very gentle with it. Okay, I'm very, very ladylike with it. Would you like to read it? Yes. Written in a scratchy... Looking at this, you can tell it was not written in... It did not have the chance. Something It was used something less refined something makeshift mm -hmm. and it was used did not use ink mm -hmm. um is it blood it might be blood i'm pretty good at telling blood but yeah it's, oh, blood. Oh, it. yeah. it's blood it doesn't appear to be written in distress mm -hmm. but it doesn't appear to be like a like a um Like, he's writing it down for posterity. Yeah. And uh, it says, Today marks the end of the, the divide on the ship. Ooh. Doc has decided to go to the upper floors and lie to them. Hell yeah. He will... Gain control of the ship, become its rightful acting captain, and oh, land God. us somewhere we can resupply ourselves. Fuck yeah. Okay. Good. I'm gonna share this with the party, and then we're gonna ask. Okay, everyone. I am gonna ask politely if I can if if I can forensic. Um, <laughs> Examine one of these bodies. I think it is a good I want idea. to know why they died. I think. That's oh, you can kind of tell just by kind of looking at them. Um, a cross between like blunt force trauma and asphyxiation. Okay. Oh, I well. apologize if I've been unclear. I'm never opposed to you examining the bodies unless they've asked beforehand or their family has asked. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. So the doctor was from a faction down here. And somehow it could turn into a regular, big, big regular zombie. Now, remember, yes, he's a zombie, but he's not a void zombie. No, oh, yeah, a the... big regular zombie. We're not sure um, how that happened. That, it does kind of, one could maybe say that the faction down here had perhaps some sort of oh, zombie-like traits. You, you had oh. a twenty-six. You had a twenty-six. Uh, that's that's high enough for a crit on this thing. Um, oh. yeah. Shoved in one of the bedrolls yes. is a writing journal. Heck yeah. That appears to be written. Uh, like this, this letter appears to have been written with the intent of put, sliding it into this book. Mm -hmm. It appears to have. Uh, it's a different handwriting, though. Mm -hmm. Um. But yeah, it appears to be actually. How well do you investigate this book? Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna take my time to investigate. I. I... We're not in a big hurry, are we? Mm -hmm. 
Ideally, yes. Okay, that's fair. Uh, okay, so do you investigate the journal, or do you just put it away with the intent of looking at it later? Ah. I look at it as we, as, as we... Okay. Give me a second as I try to... Uh, as Actually, I will yeah. recommend that we take a moment to uh, reconnoiter here, to rest, to gain our bearings, and for Eshe to find and lay out all the bodies. That's fine. Uh, uh, Percival can refocus in that 10 yeah. minutes. Yeah, yeah. Yep. All right, uh, that's fine. You, you take 10 you, minutes. You, at the, you, the party, would probably notice Hanu is on all fours on his belly on top of this box, hiding. He's spider crawled on top and it's just. Be... Actually, both Hanu and Deep Dive, uh, he's one of perceptions while people are chilling out because you are up on this box. Um, you find written in the inside page, not the inside page, but like the inside journal cover. Mm -hmm. It says, Bashim Runa MD. MD? Oh no. <laughs> the doctor's journal? Nice. 16. Uh, it's kind of hard to see from here. To be fair, Dive, uh, I don't know if you were like lo looking, but Dive, like when, like was originally around here, and she went all like went all way up, up here. And yeah. Just, like got told to come back, so she came back. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, uh, these are stairs up, and then the thing uh, is in a pit. Uh, on on that, so it's uh, so you, you didn't have the height when you came over. Mm. Uh, Han Hanu said that Dive did a good job scouting, so now she is just petting the monkey, completely ruining herself. Oh. Pet the monkey. I I spend my ten minutes reading. Do you like read thoroughly or do you skim? I I want to have an overview of the whole thing. If so if I have... find something interesting, I'll read it thoroughly, but otherwise I'll skim. If we have 10 minutes, it might be good for Percival to throw some hands at Escher. Yeah. Yeah, Escher. Thank you. Well. So as you're reading, in fact, you can take a while. As you're reading, the doctor was woken up by the AI. Because the captain grew sick. Not deathly sick, but like, yeah, I should be checked out by it. And so the doctor kept, you know, took, took care of the captain and let the captain decide. And him and the chief engineer kind of hit it off. Cap him and the captain weren't quite super friendly, but it was fine. There was mention, and I need you to roll me underworld. Did some crime stuff happening? Mm hmm. He didn't like the way the captain was planning on. He, he, he wanted to like. A situation came up, and he thought what well, the captain's decision was stupid, and he wanted to, and he he thought that he that his decision was better. And the engineer didn't really pick sides, um, but he didn't like he didn't like that his air quotes vote in the situation wasn't adhered to when talking with the captain. Uh, basically, the captain being like, "This isn't a democracy. I'm the captain. That's what we're doing." Mm -hmm. I mean, um, in fairness, that is how that works. Yes. Yep. So the doctor was not happy about that situation. And so the next page, it's like two days later. The next page says that something went wrong with the, with the ivory beds. And it's not clear. It's not entirely clear. But with 17, it might be implied he has something to do. 
with a bunch nice. of people awake. A bunch of people woke up. A bunch, like several dozen, dozens of people woke up. A lot of people didn't. Which he seems did to have. Coup. He seems to have legitimate, like not remorse, but he seems legitimately upset that a lot of people died. Um. But now all these people are awake, and things are being discussed, like, you know, food, the situation, that we didn't plan for this. And then someone brings up, and it might have been, the, someone brings up, what to do with the bodies? You can't just leave them there. Or should you leave them there? What should we do? I mean, they clearly did leave them there. Well, the captain suggests, because since the ivory bed wasn't working, they would just decay inside the pods. Which is bad. Certainly could, not ideal. It's certainly not ideal. They could. The captain suggested a uh, a space Viking funeral. Hmm? That would be my oh, instinct of how to handle it. Fuck. Um, but the doctor seeing an opportunity said no. That that was stupid. We shouldn't, we shouldn't disrespect the people that came with us like that. We should keep them until we find a place to live. And he convinced the rest of the... Most, but not all, of the people awake that he was correct. Motherfucker did a coup! Things started getting tense. And... His faction raided the armory and anything they could get tools and held up in the cargo and moved bodies from the cryo into uh, a, a, an easier... So they wouldn't decay inside them. They would they all put them all in one location and just keep them. The problem is they didn't have access to the food. That was above deck. So they needed a way to get around the barricade they set up and get into the kitchen. And they couldn't get through to the cryo section, the, the, the upstairs cryo section, because someone had barricaded the AI computer room's door. Like, absolutely. Like, nothing's getting through. They essentially, like, welded panels on and they got the door. It's hard cutting out for anyone else. Uh, I heard a mm -hmm. little cut out, but I think I got most of it. I don't think so. I think that's on you, Mooney. I'm sorry. I think that's on your side. Uh oh. Hello? You there? Hello? Mm -hmm. Can you hear yeah. me now? Am I cutting out? No, you're not. Know. Okay, cool. Um, and so eventually the doctor's like, has a uh, Eventually, no, sorry. Before all that happened, before all that happened, before they, you know, the faction happened, I've got it. This is important. The captain. Keeps trying to keep things orderly. The captain's still in charge. And is still, you know, able to get enough people on their side. And enough people of influence, too, to keep, you know, keep power. So the doctor has an idea. If the captain goes down, the next head, it's the head engineer. And then it's the, it's the doctor. And the head chief medical personnel. So... The engineer has an accident. And the doctor and the captain falls incredibly ill. They can't fix. They can't heal him, so they put him in cryo. Now the de facto captain is the chief medical officer. Motherfucker, fucking killed him. But mm -hmm. it's it's. The people of the faction, the faction of upstairs, which has less, has had a little less people, but not by much, kind of find this suspicious. As they should. As rightly they should. Right? Um, and so... It is only nice like, if the captain was being a dickhead. It doesn't sound like he was being a dickhead. He was a dickhead of being like, I'm the captain, I'm in charge, you're gonna do what I say. But he's the captain. That's how that works. Mm -hmm. uh, and the doctor didn't like that. So, so uh, he did a murder. 
He did a murder. He did a murder. Yeah, yeah. He, he did sounds like he might have done murders. two a murder. He did two murders. Yeah. The, well, I'm he never admits. He, he never admits to that. He says the head engineer had an accident. Accident. And then, an accident, and the captain f suddenly falls ill. And of course, he's the do head doctor. He's the one that has, the, you know, determines what's wrong with the captain and figures out what to do with him. Well, um. Ah, you know what? They had one good idea. Spike, space Viking funeral. Get fucked. Space, yeah. <laughs> uh, was uh, so overworked that it became destroyed with so many people. So there was no way to keep them, he, to keep the captain alive long enough to heal him. So they put him back. They put him, they, they cannibalized a bunch of machines, got at least one of them walking through the captain. In them. And then just kind of forgot about him. As the doc had to deal with all of the captain's cronies finding this incredibly suspicious. Uh -huh. Well, and so they turned on him, and so he took his cronies downstairs and locked off in the cargo bay where all the stuff is, except for the food, which was very important. And so the new de facto, the the uh, the person that decided to be in charge of the upstairs, welded off the AI room and had people on guard at all times. On every entrance they knew about from below deck to up deck. And then he decides, then it's like been a couple of weeks. People are starving. Things get bad. People get desperate. And so the whole argument of, you know, the whole thing that started this off of what to do with the bodies. Well, uh, -uh. solved it. Yeah, yeah they don't. They only go a few days. They only do this for about two days before the captain, before the doctor goes. This can't. This can't. This can't happen. This can't work. We need to find a new way. I'm going to. I have a plan. And then it kind of cuts off there. But from the, the this other dude writing a thing, the plan was for him to go up there and and lie to them and be like, look, my faction's fucking crazy. They're eating mm. corpses. They've gone nuts. That's how the man became so, a real zombie? Ah. Uh, I thought that was how you became a Wendigo. Maybe that's not a thing in Pathfinder. That's... Still cannibalism, but in a different way. Although that's so, a, that's kind of a thing that uh, you generally shouldn't bring up. I I can explain more about that later. So um, uh, you don't think eating corpses had uh had anything to do with, to do with what has occurred? Zombie. Yeah. What it could have potentially caused transmission of parasites. But that's a stretch as well. Mortuary cannibalism and survival cannibalism. Very different things. Yep. Anyway. That's what the general gist of what the book is. It's all the doctor's fault. Which is why, mm -hmm. I don't know if you noticed the captain, the doctor's name was actually... Oh no, captain. it wasn't. How is it not? So we don't. We don't necessarily know for certain because I. I'll admit I did get distracted a little bit through that. But do we know what the initial problem was that the doctor and the captain were beefing over? No, he doesn't really state. He doesn't really state. He just whatever the whatever the problem was. He thought he had a. He he not even that he didn't like. He thought he did it better. He didn't. Even, it wasn't even that. It was that he was. His up. Uh, opinion of the matter of well, the opinion of it didn't seem to matter to the captain he might have potentially had a point but you're right it's mostly his fault if you take charge you're responsible that was the captain's mm -hmm. fault well, yeah no no yes that's right but nothing went wrong or things that went wrong with the captain might have been their fault the captain was murdered by the doctor in cold seen that coming <laughs> No, no, there is no see that coming. Yes, it is. They got ill. Clone, clone. Look. Look. 
if your chief medical officer is going rogue, you gotta check up on them. See if they're gonna kill you. You know, are you going to kill us? No, but I admire Actually. craft. Hey, look, I found the AI room. <laughs> Nita, you, you <laughs> see Anu's, like, arm with the fan in it twitch slightly as you say that? Like, I can fucking get you right now if you're gonna be like morality. that. We can argue the morality of the situation either uh, later. At the moment, though, it is very apparent why this would cause... Why all of this would cause a large number of haunts to form. It might... Hmm. Wasn't there a, a haunt that was hungry? We don't know. Or mm, if there I is, I can't remember. So. so the haunts that you know of are the Whispers, the Spot, and the, the Wall. We've taken care of the Wall for the time being. Yeah. Although we will also need to clean up the bodies to make sure, you know, that's that's not a problem. Space goes coast mm -hmm. to coast. Ooh. And, uh... I made the jig so that I know you did. <laughs> Ashe says, I feel like one of the ghosts is very likely to be the captain. So, Absolutely. Cons considering what we know, do Ooh. you think that... Go on. What if the captain's actually still alive? What if they actually managed to freeze it successfully? Or... That the captain spirit is the spirit of the one that's cold because uh, it, it, it's been stuck in cry for so long. Both of those are possible, though I'd put more. I would put more weight on the second one. Look, yes, our pods survived a thousand years. Yes, We're not organic. Work. No, the pods on our ship survived a thousand years. Fair the point. The That's point fair. that I'm making, and the question I'm coming to, is uh, do you think that there's anything that we could bring with us that would prove uh, that the doctor is dead? Uh, um... uh, well, we have his head. Do you also have the, we have the credentials. credentials. You have the credentials. You have these credentials. As much as I hate to admit it, the head would probably be... Hanu did not bring the head with him. Yes, no, Ashe would have made sure you didn't do that. <laughs> yeah. but, if you want, uh, I can go up and, so, and try no, and do let's... a forensic analysis on the doctor and find out how he became a zombie. Actually, yes, that would be very useful. Okay. We can would everyone that. be alright with us backtracking for that? You don't but... need, of course you can backtrack, but we don't need to leave this scene. Of okay. course, of course. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. You, you squeezed back through the, the, the venting, which is small. You have to kind of squeeze, but you know, you know, there's nothing in there stopping you, so there's no checks. Sorry, what was um, that? What are you saying, Money? I want to check the AI room. So, yeah. so you try we'll checking the AI there. room. There is, because you also know this in the book, too. It's been welded shut. But has Do it you, been welded from, shut from the upstairs? So, no, but it's locked from upstairs. This door, mm. though, has been welded shut okay. from from the inside. Mm. So the only way to get in here is from upstairs. Okay. Can we go in from upstairs? Uh, the, they're locked, but you can try unlocking them. Yeah, like, we can... Yeah. We can tr it, it wasn't twice, we just broke the door. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, real quick. Um, uh, my forensic Nina. investigation yeah. takes five minutes, and I imagine it takes two and a half minutes to move up and back. So we can so, spend ten minutes. Yeah. Do you wanna? Do you want to? While you're doing the investigation, you all are trying to open the trap door. That sounds good. Yeah. Okay. Although Nina, one, make... one of us should definitely stick with Nina. Yeah, yeah. Nina, make <laughs> me a medicine check. Uh, I just want to try opening the trap door. Uh, who, make me a medicine check, Nina, and who wants to make me some kind of check to um, get the trap doors unlocked? Wait, what, it, what if it was? It, what if it was? Oh yeah, that's good point actually. Wait, no, it would be three for wouldn't it? Three for three for yeah. okay. Three the number one, but I'm I'm open to hearing other suggestions. Ashley can try to break through it, but she doesn't really want to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so actually, seventeen is enough in this case. Um, okay, cool. But, uh, I still need a medical check from Nina. Yeah, I'm trying to get in. Okay, sorry. 
Uh, yeah, who's who's all at the trap door? Die. Um, I uh, believe. <clears throat> I think Eshe will stay with Nina since Eshe also knows about dead things. What about what about you, Scotty? My instinct is to say one one tank should be with each part of the party. Me. Oh oh shit. Smarty's headphones died and they're the only pair. Oh no. Um are you able to listen on speakers? He can't hear you, but It is it it is, if I understand correctly, late there. It is four thirty four in the morning. Yeah. Don't have speakers. Hmm. Alrighty. Uh um, you can also click Nina's token and click medicine and skills. Alright, let me let me let me do that for you. In fact, you know what? It's late anyway. Yeah. Let's do this mm -hmm. this this last thing and I'll tell you I'll give you yeah. a finish that we can call that. That sounds good. Nice. Damn, I'm sorry. Oh, the smarty can't hear at all. Fuck. Hey. Hello? Damn. You can't hear at all on your computer? Well, if you can't hear at all, that's not gonna... <laughs> I presume I mean, the smarty has a phone. Yeah. Fair uh... point, but... It, it, I do think wrapping it is the best option. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, one, uh, Hanu and Dive, and I will move Bustle into the AI room. <laughs> Person comes with us. Uh, uh, yeah, it's an AI room. You've seen it before. However, there is a man who has a sword and is, you know, less makeshift armor, but he's here too. He's dead. Um, uh, do you check him as, do you, do you, do you, the non-medical people, check him to see if he's a zombie? Uh, see, you're good at this, I'm not. Uh, what are we trying uh, to do? You know what? It involves Percy, let's not do it. Um, Nina! Alright. Mm -hmm. You start Ooh. checking this so, out. So, it is two different checks. One to examine the body medically and one and then i i get a bonus to my next check using that information yeah uh, and i'll post so, my features here so you um so Um, he has, um, it seems that he did not initially die in the crash. Mm -hmm. Um, he attempted to survive by mm -hmm. injecting himself with, uh, a mixture of chemicals and other, and other strange, like, magics. Um, but something you also think that definitely, like, affected him is a... A, a, an unearing rage mm. that just helped transform the magic was keep you know he was using to try and keep himself alive. Yeah. Uh, ah, okay. He was using necromancy to artificially extend his life, which is a thing that you can do in a normal way or in a not good way, yeah. and a whole bunch of things. Uh, possibly his eating of human meat, possibly uh, the anger he was feeling, just all coalesced into zombification. Yeah. 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 So. So. Uh, we also get the head. Yeah, you get the head. Then... is actually gonna say, basically, let's leave that unless we turn out to need it. I don't like... I don't like defiling corpses more than I have to. Oh, okay, okay. That's fine. Um, if we need it, uh, we need it, but uh, yeah. we don't know that we do. Alrighty. And then I would like to use this this information 
to figure out um, how could I learn from this to further my craft? Could I maybe <laughs> gain research point towards life extension or making zombies? This seems like a pretty... After a thousand years, it's kind of hard to tell. Uh, I'm going to say no. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> oh, um, uh, I'll tell you now with the group uh, in the AI room. This gentleman is not a zombie. He does appear to have died from blunt force trauma. Hitting a wall. Um, but yeah, you're in the area room. I think that's where we wrap it, though. Yeah. Yeah. I think that is where we wrap it. So, thank you all so much for joining me. I. Thank I'm so sorry, much that's. For for playing. Thank you so much for GMing. And thank you everyone who joined us on the stream for watching. And thank you. Thank you to Zero for streaming and being our beloved rat. Yes, yes thank you so Zero. much. Big speak, motherfuckers. Um, and Hell I would yeah. love I would love to thank Shadow for donating and uh, helping out both the heroes and the villain. Thank you for the hero points. Excellent. Definitely we appreciate you them. did greatly. And make use of them in the future. Yes. So thank you so much. Thank you all the new faces and all the old faces. All the friends and all that have yet to become my friends. And thank you all so much. And for the, everyone in the future watching you, the Time Machines, thank you as well. Until next time. Don't forget to spread the weird. Good night, everyone. Bye-bye. Later. Bye.